with a private joke every time. I've never honked we're just the first doing, thing. That's amazing. We were just doing curry out the front. <laughs> Hello, everyone. I'm Nash. And I'm Lyle. Welcome Yay. to the show, everybody. <laughs> the number you're about to see. Uh, that's going to cost you 55 cents flat rate from a landline, whether you get through to us at Funky Dancers or not. Yeah, knowing that, this is the number to call. one 5 Get that in your noggin and in your digits, because we are playing games <laughs> and giving away buttloads of cash. Here it is. Stacks of it. Here it is. Oh. What are we playing tonight? Oh, surprise me. Oh, you're, you're joking. <laughs> it's Don't. not. It's a word finder. Something light. Be still my beating heart. <laughs> something light. And how Let do you me... play this game, Lyle? Well, there are there are six hot words up here. Six? Fi find the something in something light in the grid here. There are more than six answers, but six answers up there are going to be worth some money. How much money? I don't know. You tell me. 500? Ah, oh, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> do you know what? Someone just, missed the I've briefing. I've been inspired. <laughs> I've been inspired, Lyle. I would like to double it. Oh, you did hear something then. <laughs> yes, I did. I just forgot the first bit. I knew the double it bit. There you go, people. We are looking for the word, words, or just some letters that come before light. Look in there. Make sure you look horizontally, vertically, diagonally. They can go backwards and they can go around corners and oh, degree angles. Can't. Like this. Ready? Like that. <laughs> we look like we were, Mamma Mia. <laughs> anyway, like <laughs> if you're over 18, jump on the line. 1902 is the number to dial. Use your digits. Use the phone. In fact, you need the phone to digits. They need to work together. <laughs> just so you know, because just using your digits. Like, I'm right, calling. Matt, stop talking about digits. <laughs> You know, a thousand bucks is is nice, but not as sweet as <gasps> also giving away a ten grand. Look at Let's you! Let's chuck the bolt on it. I mean, look at me. You're amazing. Let's throw <laughs> the bolt on it. See that? See that thing right there? The horse. You in the door? No, I'm joking. Those three asterisks there represent a three-digit code break. If you can guess what that is, yeah. ten thousand in there in your hot little hands, your patootie in your pockets, in your fridge. If that's where you want to stick it, it's up to you. It's ten grand, or is it what you will? We are multi generoso and apparently multi <laughs> <laughs> right, so we're looking for six hot words. I'm lost. I just, I, just, I, I was fluff. fascinated. Where is this fluff, fluff coming from? from? <laughs> I want to tell you about his other fluff. <laughs> Hello, who am I speaking with? Glenn. Hello, Glenn. Glenn. Where are you from? Um, Mississippi. New South Wales. Hey. <laughs> DJ. Glenn, what's your word tonight? What have you found? Um. Oh. Have you found a word, Glenn, or just want to catch up? Uh, um, top. Top? T-O-P? Yeah. Is top it top life. life there, please, bottle? <laughs> I like to separate it. I like to keep it separated. They bottle very well. <laughs> they, they do bottle well. <laughs> I'm going to leave you to find your English language over there. Hi, Foster BJ. Hi, Foster BJ. Let's come with me over to the lounge room. <laughs> Uh, as the camera pans across, you can see we've um, put lots of random props in the in the lounge room tonight. Why? Just because we could. Couldn't think of a theme, so how about just random? Yeah, the mitt is so random. Now, for now, though, we are playing something light. It's it's a word finder. You're after the something part of this in here. Find it in the grid there. Now, as we said, words could be going... Uh, uh, could be coming in a straight line, vertically, horizontally, diagonally, forwards or backwards, or they could be turning one or more 90 degree turns. Now, when I say 90 degrees, I mean they will only ever turn... <laughs> stuck for words tonight, horizontally or vertically. So get cracking, everybody. They're worth a thousand bucks each. Up here, there are six lucky answers, six hot words. There we thank you very much. That are worth one thousand dollars each. That's six grand. Just, just staring at you in the face from up here. Now, if you want to, uh, how do they get their hot words? Well, before the show begins, uh, the butlers choose six of the answers to earn you the cash tonight. Now, they're locked into the grid, all right? We can't reveal anything else but those six answers. Now, they have been uh, sourced from Australian sources. Got it? Like I think white <laughs> Like I like white quo. That's right. <laughs> so get on the phone right now, 9205 Six grand up here. Now that is double money, so please make sure you call before it hits like the, the 500 buck mark again. That'd be that'd be boring. Um, <laughs> so please, if you're sitting there going, oh look, no one ever gets no one ever gets through. Um, I'm gonna wait for the next person to say their answer and then maybe go to bed. Uh, if you keep waiting for everyone's answer, then you'll probably miss out. Because the word that you could be thinking of could be a hot word. The first word you saw when the when the puzzle appeared could be a hot word. So get on the phone now, 1902 And you know, every phone call you make to the Mint Mansion tonight is going to cost you just a flat rate of 55 cents. From a landline, hi from mobiles, please make sure you're 18 years or older to play. And please, please, please make sure you get the bill payers permission or else they'll just smash you in the judder. Uh, <laughs> now it's a two-step process on the phone. So the first humans you will speak to are Nat and I. 
All right, it's a random selection process. If you're on hold, you're almost there. Stay on hold. You could be dropped in at random at any stage to speak to Nana myself and win yourself a thousand bucks. Then you never have to register. Yay! That, especially, it, did I just say especially? I hate that. What a smash people who say that. I don't know. Maybe you can ask someone. <laughs> did he just say especially? <laughs> It's two cents, what am I saying? Never have to register, just jump on the line, just like this person. How like you're on the mint. Who am I speaking to? Ben. G'day, Ben. Where are you from? Uh, Windsor. From Windsor. Lovely. Hey, Ben, what's your answer tonight? Uh, safe. Can you say that again for me? Safe light. Safe? Uh, yep. Is it, oh, you found it? Good. Running backwards in a horizontal line in the middle there. Is that safe light for Ben from Windsor Castle? Hello. Say hi to Liz for me. Not there, Ben. Never mind. Well, when I say it's not there, it is up there, but it's not one of our six pre-selected butler's hot words that's going to earn you the cash tonight. 9 to know, 2 double 5 double 8 double 5 Everyone's back in play. Don't forget, you're playing for a thousand bucks for one of these hot words. You right there, Nat? Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. I had a snotty. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Um, <laughs> lady. Uh, you're also playing, if you get one of these right, for a further $10,000 in the mint vault. The big silver shiny door behind us uh, contains $10,000. Uh, all you need to do is win one of these words and then tell us a three-digit code. If that code matches the one on the door, there it is, then you're inside. Ten grand. Now, heads up, everybody. Second last night of the Mint. Now, we need to give away this money over the next two nights or we'll just randomly draw a name out on Monday and give them the ten grand. How's that sound? Sounds pretty cool to me. <laughs> Won't be me, unfortunately, because <laughs> I'm busy yakking to you. I can't call. I can't call anyway. They'd smash me if I did. But you can. 9102558855 is the number to call. Jump on the dog and oversized novelty prop polystyrene bone and give us a call. <laughs> Something light is what you're after. Now, you're looking for a word or words or maybe just part of a word. Anything that, uh, that precedes light. Something L-I-G-H-T. Something light. Get cracking. This one is, is pretty straightforward. Uh, in fact, this is uh, one of our favourite puzzles. We've played an awful lot because it's, it's a good favourite because everything you need is up here. There's six grand staring at you right there. Six answers are there. You don't have to guess anything. You don't have to work out any complicated maths problem. You don't have to think laterally. Uh, you just think pretty literally. <laughs> get, your, get your eyes pooled for the answers. They're all up here. 9102 is the number to call. Get yourself involved tonight. End of the week. Maybe you've been working your, your bum off all week. Maybe you've been hunting boxes all week. Uh, and, and you're a bit toyed. You're thinking, gee whiz, it was only a four-day work week, but, but gosh, I'm, I'm buggered. Uh, and, and I'm working hard for my money. <laughs> turn it, turn it. Thank you very much. So uh, I'd like some easy cash tonight. Get on the phone, 9102 You could be a thousand bucks richer. In fact, you could be 11,000 bucks richer just with the one phone call. Yay, indeed. Come on, everybody. You know how to play this one. Something light. It's a word finder. Look for those straight, uh, straight line words. And also look for the words turning 90 degree corners. Uh, now, some people like to call and speak to me because <laughs> I'm so gorgeous in my plum coloured top. Hello, who's there? Craig. G'day, Craig. Where are you calling from? Uh, Sydney. Wonderful. Now, Craig, welcome to the show. Tell me, what's your word tonight? Lime. Lime? Limelight. Let's have a look. Is it limelight? I'm trying to find it. There it is. Mm. You can't find the limelight because it's always on me, Lyle. <laughs> We are playing a game and yes, we're mildly hyperactive but we're having fun in here at the Mint Mansion because there isn't a lot longer that the Mint Mansion will be around. Yes, the interest rates are going up and we can't afford to live here anymore so we're going to be moving out. So make sure you're watching tonight. Well, you are, so ace. But keep watching and tomorrow night because after that, bye! one 9025 is the number to call to get involved, to win the cash and also to talk to us before we go. So dialed, but remember you have to be over 18 if you want to play the game. If you're not over 18, feel free to email us tonight. We'll, it's anything, it's requests. Do you want random advice? It might not be good advice, but ask us. We wanted to know anything and now that we're going off air, you're going to miss us and you want to find out, that's what you should do. The mint at nine.com.au. Everyone else, you should be dialing and playing this game. Something light is what we are looking for. Double money is what we are playing for. We start off at 500 bucks. Lol, just crazy like that. Oh, did I double it? <laughs> did, did you double it or did I? I think you did, not. I doubled it. Gosh, I'm crazy like that. I doubled it because I'm really nice. <laughs> it's not contrived at all. Um, <laughs> we've doubled crazy. it, so each word is worth $1,000. We are so keen. In fact, I'm so keen to give away money. 
because I'm the nice one out of the two of us. He's wearing plum. You never trust him wearing plum. <laughs> uh, I'm so keen to give away you cash. Like you know what I'm going to do? Greek market lady. What are you talking about? I do. <laughs> and the body wants to buy a banana. I'm going to do a butler bonus. People, whack up a little thing. There you go. Oh, there it is. Hey, it's trouble. Da -dong, da -dong. What is a butler bonus? I see you ask, or I hear you ask. I don't hear it, but I'm getting ESP. What it means is the next caller that gets through. It doesn't have to be a right answer. It's just the next per person that we speak to, regardless of whether they know the answer, have an answer, doesn't matter. The next person that calls through gets $50 just for calling through. See that? want to give it to you. Give it away, give it away, give it away now. But don't forget, we give you 50 bucks before we even, you know, g'day, how are you, what's your name? Bang, 50 bucks. First step. Second step, give us your answer. If you give us the right answer, a thousand bucks on top of that. Oh, 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 wait a second. Three digits, see that silver door over there in the corner? Oh, that's, there you go. See that, those three asterisks, if you guess them, 10 grand. So, you, you feel it? You catching what I'm throwing you? You read what I'm writing? What are you doing? Lars laughing at me. $50, people. It is a butler bonus, but the only way to win it is to jump on the line if you're on hold. For the love of baby Jesus, stay there because it's the only... It's actually the first step in a two-step process. First step, going on hold. Second step, talking to us in at the house. And it is a random, like, totally random computer selection. Um, What I think I'll do, so you guys are aware when I'm going to take a call, Whack up a two minute clock close. Do love a shiny clock. Two minutes and begin. There you go. The clock is counting down, people. The next person that get through, which will be in exact, is it in exactly two minutes? Yes. In exactly two minutes. When we take the next call, you can be it. Now, don't forget, you could be holding. You can't, don't sit there and wait for the last 10 seconds to call because the computer can select some, will select someone from on hold. Aha! Uh -huh. How it does it? I don't know. Do you know why? It's totally random. That's right. So find the word something like, remember, it's horizontal, vertical, diagonal. It goes backwards and it goes round corners at right angles. What does that mean? At 90 degree angles. So it could go like in an L shape or in like a dog leg shape, but always at right angles. Easy as pie, but you have to dial first. There's only one minute and 18 seconds to get through for the ye olde butler bonus. The butlers are being a bit nice. Why? Because we're giving them a nice bonus when they leave because we had to let them go. <laughs> Sorry. But was, wow, that was handled so delicate. Yeah. Let's talk about the butler bonus. Good idea. <laughs> Don't say that like that. Good idea. Next call up, $50. Don't forget, $50 just for getting through, $1,000 for getting word, $10,000 for an extra three digits. That makes $11,050. Wow! <laughs> How good am I for figuring that out? 42 seconds, and if you're not dialing, you might not have a phone, which is okay. Then you don't necessarily have to. Remember, though, it is 55 cents flat rate from a landline. More, though, if you're calling from a mobile, so you've got the option, go to the landline any old time. You have to be 18 or over. That means from this second onwards, if you weren't born exactly 18 years ago, you just can't call. Or you can if you're over 18, obviously. But uh, let me remind you as well that it's a two-step process. There's only 19 seconds left. Two-step process, you never have to register for it. If you're not the person who pays the bill, ask the person who pays the bill. Otherwise, they may smack you on the bot bot, which you may like, but you really shouldn't push it. You know, say, can I use the phone? And then maybe you can smack me on the bot bot. There's our caller. Hello, who's this? No. What was your name, sorry? No. G'day there. Where are you calling from? Wollongong. Well, Noel from the Gong. How are you going tonight? All right. Well, congratulations. You just got yourself 50 bucks. Thanks, mate. Oh, it's all right, mate. Now, <laughs> now we've got that out of the way, let's get your answer and see if we can get, add another, bleh, another thousand on top of that. Okay. Skylight. Skylight. Skylight? Oh, is it Skylight? <laughs> oh, unfortunately not, but stay on the line. Congratulations for getting through on the butler bonus. We'll get all your details and send you 50 bucks just for getting through out to you. Everyone, did you see that? Butler bonuses, pretty darn good. And if you like, we may play a few more of them later on tonight. one 9025 is the number to dial. We still have $6,000 on this game. That's right. There are six... They call them hot words, but I, they might not be hot. They might be kind of lukewarm. But they're pre-selected words is what I'm getting at. There's six pre-selected words, so you might find words in there that fit, but they, they're not the pre-selected ones. They've all been locked in, though. Something light. It could be one word, it could be two words, three words, or it could be just a couple of letters that come before light. All I know is that each one is worth $1,000, and the only way to get involved, my funky peeps, is to pick up the phone and tell your communicado with us. Simple as that. 
So there's wonderful people. What, what are these decorations? <laughs> it is a little bit freakish, but that's okay. I've got a big net behind me, big fishing net, but the television behind me, which isn't uh, a prize, but it's still really nice. It's what you could spend your prize money on, perhaps, is a full of winners, and the winners are Joseph from Jenny from Spaffball. <laughs> what the hell is that? Spaftopol. And she won money that I didn't get to see because I was too busy trying to figure out where she was from. But if you want to be like Janet from... Oh! <laughs> well old machine, Rose, like a well old. <laughs> You'd be like Paul from Rose Hill, who won twelve hundred dollars. All you have to do is jump on the line. You can have your name up in lights. That is, of course, if we change it by tomorrow, because, like I said, <laughs> after tomorrow night we're, we're getting kicked out. There, the people are coming on. Sorry, you can't afford your interest rates. Very true. Okay, I don't know if that's necessarily the truth, but hey, it's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been giving you official story. 1902 double five double eight double five. Have you found the word words or a couple of letters that come before light? I can't hear you. So you have to dial. Did you see that? Uh huh. Amazing. There are six hot words, people. They're hot, they're spicy, they're muy caliente, and they may just be a little bit moderate as well. Depends how you like your curries. So find the word, though. That's all beside the point, the whole curry thing. $1,000 is what you could win. What you spend it on is entirely up to you. Remember, those you have to be over 18 if you want to uh, get involved. But remember, everyone who's under 18 that wants to get involved, you can email us. Here's the email address. Hello, who's this? Uh, it's Renee. Renee, where are you calling from? Uh, Berkeley Vale. Wonderful, Renee. Tell me, what's your answer? Uh, neon light. <gasps> Is it neon light? It's a good one. Flash. Flash. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't know. Something like words, word, or part of a word that come before light. Fill in the gap up here with something from down here. They'll be consecutive letters. You don't have to like. Pick letters out of everywhere. In fact, don't pick them out of these boxes down here. <laughs> this is the only place you'll find your answer. In consecutive letters in a straight line or going around a couple of 90 degree turns. Who knows? You tell us what it is. Give us a call. 1902 In fact, <laughs> thanks Gold Bar. All the important stuff is over this side. Look, I'm just the decoration on the telly screen. But here's all the important stuff. Here's the puzzle. Here's where you find the answer. That's what you have to fill in to get the answer. Here's the, here's the fun stuff just here. Is like... A thousand bucks, that's the prize you're going for tonight. Ten thousand bucks is the little, is the icing on the cake. Quite frankly, you can break into the vault, you get an extra ten grand as well. And there's the important thing, you should be punching that through right now. 1902 punch it through, Mithis, let's go. Double money, limited time, that, that's also fairly important down there. Get out of the way, gold bar. I'm trying to explain to the boys and girls at home, <laughs> that's also important. The double money is only for a limited time. I said 500 was enough for each word, but Nat Garonzi, oh look, she Sheep! Got, She's not just a pretty face. She's not just a FedEx model. She's actually pretty generous too. <laughs> she loves she, she doubled the money, a thousand bucks for a limited time only. So get involved now. <laughs> I love that. I actually love the fact you call me Fat X model. I think it's pretty funny, really. <laughs> it's this shift work. It just really packs on the pan. Oh, God, I was so skinny when I first started. <laughs> Thousand bucks for each of these hot words. Six grand up here staring at you in the face. What are you doing? Get on the phone now. End your week on a high note. Maybe you've had a really bad week. Well, why don't you end it with something a bit happier? <laughs> oh, yeah, you're earning a Don't end bucks. it, just like end the week well. <laughs> <laughs> don't end the week. Ah, poof, don't drop the toaster in the bath. Just pick up the phone, 9205 <laughs> Win yourself some cash. Tonight, 11 grand is up for grabs. Now, yes, it is our penultimate night here in the Mint Mansion. Uh, and we do have, we've got a few uh, favourite Minty moments to talk about tonight. We've got a few quotes and things to go through. In fact, why don't you email in any of your favourite minty moments? Yay! <laughs> Please, someone send something in. <laughs> or else we'll feel really entertaining, real entertaining. <laughs> so, email in any any favourite minty moments you've had. Any fun stuff, any shout outs, doesn't have to be related to our topic that we're dictating to you. There's the email address. But for goodness sakes, do not email in your answers. The only way to uh, to give us your answers is get old fashioned, get old school. 1902 The screen isn't crowded enough for me, so I'm going to ask for a 90 second clock as well. Please, butlers. Let's start it. Hey, now we are taking a caller before the clock hits zero. At least I hope that's what it's meant to mean. <laughs> Any time in the next minute and a half. <laughs> it could be in the final few seconds. It could be in the next few seconds. You never know when the caller is going to come through. So here's the way. Like I said before, this is the way to crack the clocks over the head. Jump on the phone and stay on hold. All right? Don't wait for the final lot for like 15 second mark. You go, oh, I'll call through now and I'll just I'll smash them at the end of the end of the clock. No, call now. And just be on hold, waiting at random. You could be plucked out of the, the ether and dropped into the mint mansion. And uh, and talking to Nana myself, 
told to me. Uh, and uh, earning yourself a thousand bucks. If you can give us one of our butler's pre selected hot words, there are six up there. I uh, played a word finder the other night with Kat. Bang! First answer went very quickly to, to, uh, to a serial winner, actually. Ralph from Sydney was our uh, our first winner the other night, and he's won like six times on the mint. I thought you meant like he won heaps of Sultana brand or something. <laughs> like, a serial what? winner. <laughs> you know we gave away cereal. That was funny. It was, it was a bit dad joke, but it made me giggle. Yay! <laughs> Yay! <Woo -boo. laughs> Less than 30 seconds left. Channel on the phone now, 9202555855. If you're not on hold, it is not too late. Well, it could be. I don't know when the call's coming through, but there's still 20 seconds left. Sometime in the next 20 seconds, we'll speak to someone. Might be you, if you're not sitting there on hold right now. I don't know what sort of the music they're playing you these days on hold, but I'm sure you can sit through it for another 10 seconds. You've got less than 10 seconds left. Before we're going to speak to someone, hopefully give away the first money of the night. Stop that clock. Speak to me. Hello, who's there? It's Renee from Berkeley Vale again. Renee, again? Yes, I'm <gasps> trying to get the money to pay for the phone bill. <laughs> <laughs> She's stalking us. She's outside the, the door waving a fork. Renee, what's your answer this time? Uh, tail light. Oh, tail light. Let's, let's see if this one does it for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> what, what was that noise you just made, Matt? I was, what, when, I, when I walk, you know, because I'm a fat ex model, you know when you walk backwards? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> The sound of a big, big lorry backing it's up. It's never been done before, that joke. <laughs> oh, okay, maybe I should keep talking. Yeah, go um, on. So, hi. My, oh, look, if I do this, look. Oh, my little children. I look like I've got a halo. <laughs> <laughs> look, Mum, I'm good and stuff. We are playing a game in case you thought it wasn't, hey, let's just let Nat talk for a few hours show. We're actually <laughs> playing a game and this is it. It's a word finder. You've seen it before, you've played it before, but on the off chance that you haven't, let me tell you all about it. It is easy as stuff that's like heaps easy and stuff. All you have to do is give us a word, maybe multiple words, or even just a couple of letters that come before light. So something light or light. I don't know. All you have to do is find it in here. Words go horizontal, vertical, diagonal. They go backwards and they go round corners at right angles. So it like might be in an L shape or it might be kind of like in a dog leg or maybe even in a box shape. Who knows? All I, wow, I felt like Ange then. Who knows? All I know is that you guys have to find it and I got the cash for you. So the way the transaction kind of happens, you call me, give me the answer. I go, yay. Everything gets excited. We give you cash and then we go, hang on, before you go, give me three digits and if you guess the vault stuff right, then we go, oh, $10,000. And then you, like, dance, your happy dance at home and maybe pass out, but please don't do that. And if you do, you should have ambulance coverage because that's pretty good. And it's only $50 a year for a single. Uh, <laughs> one night or two. <laughs> Sorry, I saw the commercial before I came in. One nine oh two <laughs> went down, I mean, down. One nine oh two double five double eight double five is the number to dial and I've been inspired by myself. And we've decided to put up another 90 second clock, please. One minute 30. Oh, and in. Can you do that thing so, like, it makes my holy halo go twinkle? Ready? Bing. <laughs> <laughs> Is this going to be weird? It's going to happen. Are you dialing? Oh. It's the immaculate conception. It's not going to happen. I'm just, just pretend I'm in tension. I'm not talking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my little children. One minute left. Oh, no. Oh, cack and pop. There's 51 seconds. Are you dialing? Are you dialing? You should be because the caller could come at any time. Could be now. Please make the thing go again. Oh. Ah! <laughs> So happy. 38 seconds left, people. The call could come now, or it could come before the clock hits a zero, zero, colon, zero, zero. Oh, sorry, colon, if you can be polite. Don't forget, you have to dial one nine zero two double five double eight double five. but you have to be over 18 to get involved. Make sure you ask the bill payers permission if you can use the phone, otherwise they may come up to you and knee you really hard in the groin, which may or may not hurt, depending if you're like a Ken doll and you just have a skin mound. <laughs> that would be weird, though. Call, if, if, if that's the case... That's fine, and but you might want to like have a more kind of pro higher priority call to make. Possible, perhaps. Hello, is this? Uh, Tim. Tim, where are you calling from? Uh, Sydney. Yeah, Tim from Sydney. Tell me, what's your answer? Uh, lime light. Warm light. No, lime. Lime. Oh, like the lime light. Yeah. <laughs> is it lime light? For Timbo. Not there for Timbo. Oh, come sit with me on the couch, everybody. We're going to serious things up a little bit right now. Here's what we want you to do. Grab a seat with me. <laughs> Loosen your, your black tie of your plum shirt and have a look at this grid here. No words have gone yet. You're all safe. 
the $6,000 in the kitty this evening has, uh, has not been touched yet. But what we need you to do is be the first caller through with our first hot word. Something light. You'll find it, as always, up here. You could be looking in a straight line. Vertically, horizontally, diagonally, forwards or backwards. Or you could be looking at for an answer that goes around one or more 90 degree turns. And when I say 90 degrees, I do mean only horizontally or vertically. They will never turn diagonal corners. If the word you found makes a diagonal turn, you're not going to win any money on it. It won't be a hot word. That makes it easier for you, less answers. Of course, once you score one of our hot words tonight, 1,000 bucks in your man bag. Thanks for coming. We'll also ask you then for a three digit pin. If that pin matches the one on the vault door, you could be a further $10,000 richer. It is our second last night here in the Mint Mansion. Oh, go on now, come and help me out. <laughs> just try to, just keep little, 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 little oh, thanks bit. thanks very much. It's all right, my darling. Does that look nice That's now? That's nice. Trishy? Thanks. Eyebrows? You're not just look, you don't just look like a mama tonight. You're actually coming and fixing my clothes as well. Mr. Liner? There you go. I'm going to smash you. Bye. Punch me in the Okay. Did a Lyle exit. <laughs> Talk about my exit. <laughs> Lost my train of thought, so let's start again. Word fun of this evening, 1902 is the number to call. Pick yourself minted at the end of the week. A thousand bucks, that's double money. Make sure you call sooner rather than later before that money drops back down to $500. In fact, here's a little hint. I don't know whether I'll get in trouble for this, but we're only showing in New South Wales at the moment. So if you were smart, you'd call in before Queensland joins us later on and there's more people. And you know what money grubbers they are in Queensland? My goodness. I'm not going to tell you when they're coming in, but they're not here yet. So why don't you call now? when you're only playing against your fellow New South Welshman. That's my hint, and I'll quickly my bot bot smack for it. Call in now, 1902 Every phone call you make to the Mint this evening will cost you just a flat rate of 55 cents from a landline. The rate is higher from mobiles. Please make sure you get the bill payers' permission in the house and that you are over 18 years old to play 18 or over. And if you're waiting to turn 18, before you're playing, you better hope your birthday is tomorrow. It's a two-step process on the phones. If you're on hold right now, please stay there. Leave the phone next to your ear. Don't put it down. Don't go and make a cup of tea. That would be silly. Don't go feed your lucky cat. Keep the phone to your ear. No matter how bad that hold music gets, stay there. You could be dropped in at random at any stage. Just speak to Nat or myself this evening. And earn yourself a thousand bucks. I'm, um, Getting impatient. I'm getting a bit social. So let's, uh, Butlers, may I have a 60 second clock? Thanks. Let's start it. We're going to take a caller before the clock hits zero. That's how this works. And uh, my little tactic with these clocks would be this get on the phone and get on hold now. Do not wait for that clock to go down near zero because the call could come through at any time. In the next few seconds, in the final few seconds, you just don't know. It's whenever the Butlers press the button. Computer will randomly select you only if you're on hold. Make sure you're on hold right now. Definitely now, don't go. Don't put the phone down and walk around the house clomping your shoes, Nat Garonzi. You've got less than 30 seconds before we're speaking to someone. Better be you if you want the money. 15 seconds to go. And this caller could be our first winner for the night. Remember the first caller through with each of our six hot words. Fix themselves the money, stop the clock. Hello, who's there? Sean Kelly. G'day, Sean. Where are you calling from? Uh, just from Newcastle. Lovely. Sean, welcome to the show. What have you got for me? I uh, just got a fog light. A fog light? Good. Good original answer. Let's see if it's on our list. Not there. It is up there in the uh, in the puzzle, but not one of our pre-selected hot words. There are six of those. The hot words were chosen before the show began tonight and locked into the grid. 
Those six and only those six words can be revealed. We can't change the, the grid here, we can't change the answers. It's all locked in. And now Nat and I do not know these answers this evening. Don't trust us with them. Props to you, I say, but that sounds a good idea. Don't tell us. Uh, Nat and I are re uh, revealing, are relying on you to reveal what these answers are. We're relying on you to call us and tell us. If you can spot one of the six hot words, you'll earn yourself $1,000. So you don't have to find six words tonight, just one. As soon as you've found one answer up here in the puzzle, jump on the phone. You could be looking for a word, or maybe just part of a word. You could be looking for a couple of words. Any number of consecutive letters that you can find here and put in front of that, light. It could be a hot word. Looking. Don't forget, even when you are on hold or dialing, keep looking at the puzzle. You don't want to miss out on any words this evening. You don't want to overlook any potential hot words. On the other hand, you don't want to be sitting there looking at the grid all night and making a list and not dialing. It's no use you having the words written down or in your head if you aren't calling and exchanging that for $1,000. I'm getting a bit itchy now. <laughs> Beg your pardon. <laughs> Itching to speak to someone, that is. Let's put up another minute clock, please, Butlers. And whack it on, whack it off. Let's go. Minutes to go. Once again, we'll be speaking to someone before the clock hits zero. And the way to beat this is call now and wait on hold. 1902 Most phone calls you make, you dread being on hold. Called a certain company the other day and was on hold for about an hour 20. And I wanted to stick a knitting needle in my urethra. But being on hold with the mint is the place to be. 30 seconds to go. Because it could be worth $11,000 now. <laughs> 16 seconds left before we speak to someone, hopefully. <laughs> the right answer. And this code jacket for now. Stop the clock. Nine seconds to go. Hello, who's there? Oh, uh, yeah, Craig. Here you go, mate. Craig, uh, same Craig as we spoke to before? Uh, bad. Y no, yes, no. Did we speak to you before, Craig? No. No, OK, sorry, Craig. Not that I'm implying there's only one Craig in Australia. I'm sure there's more than one. Sorry, Craig. Welcome to the show. What have you got for us? Uh, bad light. Can you say that again for me? Bad light. Bad. Spell it for me. B-A-D. B-A-D. Sorry, Craig. Bad light. Let's see if it's there. Not the Craig. Now we apologise, I apologise in advance if I do ask you to spell out your answer. You may think I just sound a bit silly, but <laughs> there is reason to the method to the madness. Uh, sometimes we have a bad connection or not sure what you're saying. Some letters sound the same. We just want to hear exactly what you want your answer to be. But you don't hang out going, oh, they didn't hear my answer correctly. So be prepared uh, if we ask to spell out your answer. Then it's fair on everybody. We do want to give you the cash tonight. Make sure we hear what you want your answer to be. Maybe think of a really funny way to spell out your answer. B for Burjo. A for Adriana. D for depression. Whatever you like. Something light. Remember you're looking for a word or words or just part of a word. Something light. Look for the something part of that in here. Remember, you're not only playing for $1,000 tonight for the right word here, but also a further $10,000 in the mint vault. Let's cop a look at that. Not the money, just the vault. $10,000 is hiding behind the mint vault doors. If you get one of those hot words correct, that's $1,000 guaranteed. We'll then ask you for a three-digit pin. If that pin matches the one on the vault doors, you're inside. Mm -hmm. 
how much do you want to be in there? As we said before, and we'll keep saying, it's our second last night that we're broadcasting the Mint. <laughs> <laughs> That's over there cutting herself. She should be cleaning. She'd be trying to get rid of the stain on the floor so we get our bond back. <laughs> Two nights to go in the Mint Vault. Now, uh, if you get into the Vault tonight, you only have to wait one more night. We'll reset the code. If no one else breaks into the Vault by tomorrow, the $10,000 is all yours. By the end of tomorrow night, if no one has broken into the Mint Vault, we will draw a name at random. From all of our parts winners over the past couple of months, we'll draw a name at random on Monday and award them the $10,000. But let's, may I please have a minute clock? very much and let's bang it off there we go less than a minute ago you know how this works if you don't you probably haven't ever watched before <laughs> a minute clock means we're taking a caller before the clock hits zero make sure it's you be on hold right now have your word ready we're going in a break right now we're taking the caller in the break keep dialing keep on hold hopefully it's you we speak to and earn the cash Welcome back to the well-oiled machine that is the Mint. I've got Huck on the line. Huck, you there? Huck, you there? Yep, I'm Hello. There. Oh, well done. Hey, congratulations. It's your first time through to the Mint Mansion. Let's make you a first-time winner as well. What's oh, your answer you. tonight? What's your answer? Uh, my number, uh, answer will be fog light. Fog light? F-O-G. Let's have a look for fog light for you. Fingers crossed. Mm, not there. Did you break something there? Hello. Look, do you know what's funny? Everyone freaks out because I'm not speaking and this is like I'm the only person that doesn't stop speaking. And this side is about myself. You couldn't see that. I didn't need to say that out loud. <laughs> Hi, how you all going, eh? We are playing a game. And it is called a word finder. It is simple. In fact, it tells you exactly what to do just in the title. Find word or find words, or find a few letters that go before light. See how there's a line, something light? That's what you're looking for. And this is the way to do it. They're gonna be horizontally, vertically, diagonally. They're also gonna go backwards. So it could be like that, or like that, or like that. Oh, that's hard to do. And also they can go around corners at right angles. So it could be like an L shape or a box shape or a dog leg shape, but they have to be at 90 degree angles. So once you've found your word, letter maybe, just give us a call, 1902 55 Call costs are a wee 55 cents flat rate from a landline. Don't know where that came from. 55 cents flat rate from a landline. More if you are calling from a mobile, so if you've got the choice, go ye olde landline any old time. It is a two-step process. You never have to register for that process. And just so you know, if you're not the person who pays the bill, ask the person who pays the bill, or they may well just snap you. Not like in a beatnik po poem way. Eh? Oh, snaps for you. No, like, wah! So, jump on the line. Hey, if you're on the line, in fact, if you're on hold, don't go changing. It is a great place to be purely because of the fact that that is where we get our calls from, the old holding bay. So, wait there for us. In fact, I'll tell you exactly how long you should be waiting. Wake up a clock, please. Kind of one minute clock. And begin the clock. Now, at any time in this next minute, we're going to take a call. Well, I will. Lyle isn't going to take it unless I combust on the spot and he has to take the call for me, which I won't. So, jump on the line because I could take it in five seconds or I could take it before the clock hits zero, zero, either way. So, make sure you're dialing now. Don't wait till the last seconds because it could come at 20. All I know is there's 30... Five left on the clock, so you should be dialing. Remember, each word is worth, like it says, just... Oh, can I do it? There. A thousand dollars. That looks weird. It looks like there's just a random hand coming in. Hello. I'm like Rob trying to pick up the puzzle. Hey, you look sexy. Are you dialing? One nine zero two double five and double eight double five. It's a thousand bucks that could be in your pocket by the end. Of, well, maybe it won't get in your pocket by the end of the night, but it'll be in your, your, your psyche, and that's a good thing. <laughs> Hello, who's this? Natasha. Natasha, where are you calling from? Inside. Whereabouts? Inside in Sydney. Oh, lovely year, oldie. Do inside now. Tell me, what's your answer, Natasha? Safe. Safe. S A F E. 
Yep. Safe light. The old safe light. Kind of like a safe word. <sighs> Wasn't that? A bit closer. That is good for you. Do you know why? Everyone except Natasha. Although Natasha, it's good for you too because you can now you know what it's not, so you can call back again. It's only fifty-five cents. Set yourself a budget. You can just call back. But everyone else, now you are now one step closer to the right answer because you know that it's not what she said. <laughs> it's not what she said. Are you dialing? I hope so because I can't hear. You. There is no other way for me to find out the answer. You can't email it. If you do, you smell. <laughs> hey, don't forget as well, we have $1,000 up for grabs for this one word alone, but we also have the vault on at the moment. So that means that if you call through and guess that two digit code breaker, sorry, the three digit code breaker in the next call, <laughs> Sorry, if you can call through and guess that three digit code breaker, you're the only person in there by tomorrow night. You get all $10,000 just for you. Isn't that exciting? What you do with it is entirely up to you. Now, what's also happening is because the show's ending tomorrow, tomorrow is our last show. I know, don't cry. I know you're devoed, we're all devoed, but we're staying pos because that's what we do. Uh, what we're doing is anyone who gives us a call and has a crack at the vault, is their name is gone into a big barrel. And if no one guesses it in the next two nights, we're going to draw out of that barrel and someone is going to win at the cash in there. So unless we get to give it away, don't think it's, you know, it's going nowhere. It's not. It's still going to you guys. So it's still definitely worth giving us a call. It's a potential $11,000 just for one call. Thank you very much. Have you found a word? Have a look in here. Next to me, noggin. Can I put up another clock? It's like we were, it's like we're connected by a thing in my ear or something. <laughs> hello? All right. I said hello and I was there. One minute 30, begin the clock. Wonderful. Now that clock's ticking down and ticking down, but it is not going to hit zero, zero, colon, zero, zero. So make sure you dial through now because it could come through in five seconds or it could come through in one minute and 16 because there's 18 left and it's not going to hit zero, zero. Get it? Oh. Remember, dialing is the only way to get through. Remember, you have to be 18, and remember, that being on hold is a good place to be. But do while you're on hold, turn the telly down a wee bit, because if we call through, there's that four-second delay in case someone says rude word. Like, beep. Beep. Fifty seconds. Forty-seven seconds. Forty-four seconds. Wow, nine months of the show, lost all my material. <laughs> 39 seconds! You should be dialing because it's a fat load of cash. Make sure you do if you have the chance though and you want to know all about our terms and conditions, jump on our website www.9msn.com forward slash the mint. It's only going to be there for a couple of days. So if you want to get a copy of the terms and conditions, get them now before they disappear into the interwebs forever. 17 seconds left, people. You should be dialing. That's what all the cool people are doing. Brangelina. I know I say them all the time, but I can't remember who else is cool. <laughs> Hello, who's this? Luke. Luke, where are you calling from? Penrith. <laughs> Luke from Penrith. How are you going tonight? Not too bad. Awesome. Hey, Luke, what's your word? Uh, ray of light. <gasps> like Madonna's song? Yeah. <laughs> Nat, my turn. Thanks. Sephir in the ray of the <laughs> looking for something light tonight. Fill in the something with something in here. Any consecutive letters, don't go pulling letters out of everywhere. They should be in a, a straight line. Vertical, horizontal, or diagonal, or our answers tonight could be going around corners of 90 degrees, either turning horizontally or turning vertically. Each of our six pre selected Butler's hot words are worth $1,000. That is double money, so please make sure you do not wait for that money to drop back down to $500 before you call. Jump in quick, 1902 5588. Double five is the number to call, as always. And for the next two nights only, before we have to move out of here. It's been a hoot. The good thing about only being two nights left, though, is, of course, our mint vault will be given away. If no one breaks into that vault in the next few nights, including tonight, 
we will give away that money. In any case, but we'll only be drawing names out of the barrel of people who have won before. So to be eligible for that cash, the $10,000, you have to be a winner. So first of all, find yourself a hot word. Could be a word, could be a few words, could be just part of a word. Something that comes before light. Something, L-I-G-H-T. And jump on the, on the phone. In fact, do it quickly because I'm going to ask for a clock. How about a minute 30? <laughs> oh, oh my God, it's like you read my mind. I was trying to be natural and all. Start the clock. <laughs> we are taking a caller before the clock hits zero. At any stage in the next minute and a half, we could be speaking to you, but only if you're on hold right now. Don't wait. Don't anticipate women when it's coming through. Just jump on the phone and wait on hold. Got Lucky Cat in the background there. Lucky Cat goes to whoever gives away the most money in the night. Will it be Nat or myself tonight? Probably don't give a hoot. <laughs> as long as you are receiving the money, you don't care who gives it to you. What are you going to spend the money on? Clothes? Lattes? Go out clubbing? Not seal clubbing. <laughs> it's quite cheap, you wouldn't need... Well, you'd have to fly to Canada. Let's get off seal clubbing. You can do what you like with the money. We don't tell you how to spend the money. We just give it to you. And a big novelty check delivered by Kerry Ann. Wearing no pants, just on your doorstep singing, I love you. 25 seconds left before we speak to someone. Make sure it's you. Get on hold right now. Stay on the phone. Keep the phone to your ear. We'll be speaking to you at random at any stage in the next 16 seconds. Have your word ready. Don't forget to keep looking for words up there. Stop the clock. Hello, you're on the mint. Who am I speaking to? Uh, Ken. Ken, hello. Ken, where are you calling from? Uh, Chittaway Bay. Lovely. Hey, Ken, welcome to the show. Good. What have you got for me? Um, flashlight. Flashlight, good one. Is flashlight there for us? Unfortunately, not Ken. Bad cake. <laughs> well, what I've got cake, don't we? Iron fat, iron fat. That is another one to cross off your list. Not cake. Ken's answer, flashlight. It is always well worth making note of uh, wrong answers that people say. Then you know that you won't be repeating them. Okie dokie. Little tip from me. Now, when you think you have an answer ready, 1902-555-8855. Every phone call you make from the Mint to the Mint Mansion, sorry, will cost you just a flat rate of 55 cents from a landline. Higher from mobiles. Please make sure you're 18 or over to play any games with us here in the Mint Mansion because the games we play are all quite adult. And please make sure you have the bill pay's permission. It's a two-step process. As I said, if you're on hold, stay right there. Now, you never have to register with the Mint, which is good. You don't have to leave your details. You can call through once, twice, as many times as you like. Set yourself a little budget and then get cracking. down your chalk banana, pick up the phone if you can find an answer up there, 1902 Be dialing, be calling, not pinching and rolling. Give us a call now. A thousand bucks could be yours. Why is there more laughter in the background? I think one of our other mint mates has come downstairs. She heard Nat's beautiful Twitter. I think, I think we might have to drag her on camera at some stage. Maybe after the next ad break. Do your face up. You look hideous. And we'll bring you out and show Australia. Who's dropped down to visit us? Aren't we lucky? She might even sing a song. She might play some ping pong. She might do anything. Who knows? Something light is what we're after right now. All shenanigans aside. Serious stuff. 1902 as soon as you found even just one. You don't have to find all six hot words at once. We had someone call the other night and say, oh, well, here are the six I found. Don't worry about that, just find one. Have a few on standby, just in case. You could be on hold. You could be on hold and someone might say the word that you were thinking of. What are you going to do then? Make sure you have a standby. Now, let's, uh, let's have a clock. Let's have a clock, kids. Hit a 30. Go on then. Let's start it. Clock is ticking down. Get yourself involved. We are in the next minute and a half, we will speak to someone out there. Could be the next few seconds, could be the last few seconds. 
You never know when that corpse is coming through. So full of surprises here in the Mint Mansion. I like to give it away. Nat loves to give. There's a few penultimate night shenanigans going on tonight, but... Hey! What are they going to do? Fire us! <laughs> 50 seconds to go <laughs> before we speak to someone. It could happen in the last few seconds. It could be in the next few seconds. In fact, you know what? We're going on a break, so I can smash Nat. We are taking this call, though, during the break. Make sure you're on hold right now, and hopefully I'm giving you the cash soon. Welcome back to The Mint, everybody. Oh, I've got Suzanne on the line. Suzanne, are you there? Yes. Yeah. Suzanne from New South Wales. Tell me, what was the name of you? Where are you from again? Mooring. I've never heard of it, but now I know where it is. Suzanne, welcome to the show. What have you got for me tonight? What's your answer? Sky. Sky? Yes. Is it Skylight? Let's have a look. <laughs> Not there. Guess what, Lyle? What, So Natalie? I was um, started packing up, packing up the the, um, the bar and <laughs> curled up in some, in like a whiskey bottle. Was look, what? look who I found, Lizzie! Hey. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. I, was a, I was in a whiskey bottle. That's just <laughs> like, I was like, oh. <laughs> she um, was like that hiccuping um, mouse in Alice in Wonderland. Twinkle, twinkle, little. It was me. It was me. Thanks for getting me out of there. I was really claustrophobic. Did my wonderful giggling laugh wake you up? <laughs> it was. It was. And the urethra thing. <laughs> <laughs> Don't you love when you sit there and go, just let it go. No one heard it. Yeah, she's good. At least they're going, yeah, da 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 well, if you're going to sit here and hang here, yes. I might go and pack my box with stuff. <laughs> <laughs> okay? <laughs> High fives with BJ. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Welcome to the show. My name is Lucy, that's right. Three housemates tonight for the price of two. What more could you want? I'm just stuck down because I've got no life and I'm quite bored. That's right. <laughs> and I could hear lots of giggling. And look, two of my favourite people are here, so I had to come down and join in the festivities. Two We're off. playing <laughs> two off. Thanks. <laughs> Two of the housemates, you know, just know I love them. Two of my favourites, you know that, deep down. We are playing a word finder puzzle. And look, the money was obviously doubled by who I don't know. Possibly, Garons. Possibly Natalie. Was it Natalie tonight? It was. She was feeling generous. She doubled the money. The answers are worth 500. Now they're worth 1,000. And how many answers are in there? Well, really, I have no idea. Possibly six. Yeah. Do you good. That's a good start. <laughs> six answers, six chances. Smooth. Are you dialing? <laughs> 19025-8855. If you have just joined us, so welcome to the show. My name is Lucy. <laughs> I am here with Lyle and Nat. I know three hosts for the price of two, like I said before, which is very exciting. But I'm just going to be ducking in and out, so don't get too comfortable. We are playing a word, find a puzzle this Friday night. Something light. That's right, it can be a word. It could be words or part of a word that comes before light. There are six answers in there. Six chances to get your hands on $1,000 and a crack at the vault. What does that mean? Well, it means if you call in, give me one of these hot words. Not only do you get $1,000 just like that, you also get a crack at that big silver shiny thing behind me, that big door. That's right, and if you don't get the money tonight, well, I'll tell you what, we're going to pack it up tomorrow and take it home with all of us. We'll ask you for a three-digit code. <laughs> if it matches our three-digit code, you get all the cash in there. If you don't, I'm taking it home in about 24 hours' time. You're live on the mirror with Lucy. Who's that? It's Suzanne. Suzanne, where are you calling from tonight? Mary. Fantastic. Suzanne what again. <laughs> yes, I am. Second good. time. Whoa. And what word have you found for us, Suzanne? I have you got moon? M-E-O-N. Can you say that one more time? Can you say, can repeat that, Susan? Neon. Neon? Yes. Neon. Is it neon? Ooh, no, not there. Not there. Everyone, you're all back in play. It's all good news. No answers have gone off yet. So they're all still sitting in there. Look, it's only a little box, so, you know, lots of words, lots of possibilities, lots of opportunities. Remember, words can run horizontally, vertically, oh, diagonally, forwards, backwards, and around corners at right angles. Nat's just packing. Oh, that's a little bit sad, isn't it? Oh, something light. Remember, when you call the, when you call the Mint Mansion, it will cost you a flat rate of 55 cents from your landline. It will be slightly higher from your mobile phone. You must be over 18 years old to call. And if you're not the bill payer, make sure you have their permission. Once that's all sorted, find your a word, something light, and get dialing because you could be the first winner of the night. 
walk in, take a grand away, maybe you'll crack the vault. $11,000. Are you packing that? Is that going straight into your bedroom? No. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, where's that all going? I want to know who's getting the couch. Personally, I've got dibs on the couch. I don't know about you, Lyle, but couch is definitely coming with me. <laughs> got evicted. <laughs> you know what, Lyle? I've been practising something what? and I want to show you this. Oh, dear God. Yes, go on. <sighs> Let's do a butler bonus. <gasps> Wow! That's really good. Was that good? That was really good. I know, I've been practicing that Do one it just again, you. To prove okay. it wasn't a fluke. And then I'll have to explain what it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, small things, small minds. What does a butler banner mean? The next caller will win $50 regardless of the answer. That's right. Call in. If I take your call, 50 bucks, that's it. You don't even have to give me the right answer. You don't have to give me an answer. You could just put, laugh hysterically into the phone, like I tend to do, and I would give you $50. That's right. So get dialing now, because not only could you win the answer and get 1000 you could get 50 as well, and the 10000 you crack the vault. That's $11,050 you're in play for. Is my math okay? That's good. Was, was that good? No, it's fire. Oh, that's right. Let me just repeat this if you're not sure what this butler bonus is. <laughs> Looks really realistic, doesn't it? It means the next caller three wins $50 regardless. I do not even need the right answer. I could have a wrong answer. You could just give me your name and then say, look, I don't even know the answer. I just wanted to tell you, Lucy, that you're my favourite host. I love you dearly. I'm going to miss you. And I would give you $50. That's right. $50 regardless. But then you would, you know what? If you get the right answer, I give you another $1,000 and a crack at the vault. I know. It's all a bit too much. $50 for nothing. $50 for absolutely nada. Let's put a clock up and start that clock. Oh, that little flashy thing was exactly the right... Oh, oh I'm liking that. Oh, oh there we go. Oh. Oh, there we go. We will take a caller before that clock hits zero. That's right. It could come through at any time. It comes through in the next 10 seconds, the next 30 seconds, the next minute, but it will come through before the clock hits zero. And that caller will win the $50. That's right. I feel like Lyle when I do that. Do I look like Lyle when I do that? Stop oh. killing me, please. <laughs> <laughs> what stays in the mansion stays in the mansion. No. <laughs> what happens in the mansion stays Pick up in the, the frog mansion. And bone. Oh, <laughs> she's on fire. She's on fire tonight. <laughs> Lots of stories, lots of stories. How will we tell these stories? I want to know one day. Maybe we'll do a blog on our old defunct website one day. I'm not sure. 44 seconds and counting down. That's right, the angel music is playing because you could be the next caller. Don't wait till it gets down to zero to call. Call now. Get on hold. Get excited. Turn your TV down. Do a little merry jig of happiness in preparation to speak to me because you could be this next caller. The butler bonus caller. 50 bucks for nothing. Oh, that was a good one. Ooh, oh, oh. I'm going to really miss doing <laughs> oh, oh, the golden bars are giving me encouragement. 16 seconds and counting down. Will you be the next caller? Stop the clock. Oh, you're live on the Me With Lucy. Who's that? Hello? Hello. Hi, who's that? Debbie. Debbie, where are you calling from tonight? From Glenmore Park. Fantastic, Debbie. Guess what? You I'm just the $50 winner. You are the $50 winner. Congratulations. Thank you. Now, what's your answer? Let's see if we can give you another 1000 bucks. Daylight. Is it daylight? Ooh. Ooh. Not daylight. <laughs> Nine, everybody. Everyone's back in play. 9902 Thanks for coming down, Lucy. Sprucing your face up a little bit <laughs> and playing along with us all. 1000 bucks uh, is, uh, is double money for a limited time. Yes, Nat put the money up at the start of the night. She likes everything in double portions now. She's given up modelling. She, uh, she likes the big, big size pieces of everything. Double it. 1000 bucks, she said, uh, plus the chance to play for $10,000 in the vault. Now, that's, that's not going to go back down. That's normal money, 10000 bucks. The $1,000 is double. Do not wait for that money to go back down to 500 before you give us a call. Something light. What have you found? Up here. <laughs> <laughs> Find there's something part of it up in the puzzle here somewhere. It could be going in a straight line. Vertically, horizontally, diagonally, either way, forwards or backwards, or it could be taking one or more 90 degree turns. You know how to play word finders. You've, you've played them in the magazines and newspapers and stuff, haven't you? In fact, I, I was reading a magazine that I was reading, like a woman's day or something the other day, Lucy, and I was reading an article about how uh, they're, they're dedicating some new hospital wing in memory of Princess Di, and I was really sad. Because I didn't know she'd even died. I thought they would have made a bit more of a fuss about it in the press and stuff, quite frankly. Um, <laughs> something light is what you're after tonight. 1902 double five double eight double five. Double money for a limited time.
<laughs> so get on the phone right now while I'm giving you blue steel. There we go, something like... Uh, now, it's in consecutive letters, all right? That's the main thing. Uh, but they will never... These answers will never turn a diagonal corner. If they do turn a corner, they'll turn either horizontally, go like that, or turn vertically. If you find a word and it makes a diagonal turn at any stage, wipe it off your list. Get it out of your mind. Cleanse your wow of this word. It will not win you any money. Uh, that makes it easier for you. OK, we've cut out the words that turn diagonally. Uh, they're not going to be answers. So it makes it easier for you. Less answers, more chances for you to win at the $1,000. 9025 Jump on the phone right now, please. Something like, could be a word. Could be just be part of a word. Could be a couple of words. I don't know. Now, uh, Nat and I don't know the, the answers. Lucy doesn't know. She, she wasn't even at the briefing, <laughs> obviously. So we are, all three of us are relying on you to call us tonight and tell us what they are. Yes, Lucy's downstairs for the night as well. So it's Lyle, Nat and Lucy in the house tonight. Lucy's got, a, got her Kylie gig tomorrow night in Sydney. She's going off to be, imitate Kylie. Like she can any good at that. <laughs> She's absolutely rubbish at it. <laughs> oh, she does all right, I guess. <laughs> she gets by. She makes a quid or two. <laughs> Lucy won't be uh, in the mansion tomorrow night. We'll have uh, all other five hosts in, though. But tonight, that's why Lucy's in here tonight. Oh, don't throw the hand at me, please. High five. High five for BJ. In fact, you know what? Now that I've got all this stuff here to trip over and play with, I feeling a bit mad. Why don't we, um, why don't we play some Minute Madness? Yeah, baby! Pop up a minute clock. Come here, Luce. High fives for baby Jesus. Give it to me. Bring it on. Yes, thank you very much. Minute Madness means we're taking a caller before the clock hits. Zero, zero, Colin, zero, zero. Oh, last said Colin. How very naughty. Well, it's a Minute Madness. I'm allowed to. 1902-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5-5
<laughs> we're just sorting that out now for you. Hopefully, after all this kerfuffle, we can make a 10 grand richer. Let's try again for you, Michael. No worries. Oh, all right. I won't sure break this it time? this time. See? What does this button do? Good <laughs> time. Seven. Three. Oh. oh, Michael, not the one we need. Never mind, stay on the line there. You've won $1,000. Coming cool. your way, we'll get all your details. Thank How's you. that, everybody? First winner for the night, and that quick. See, you sit there, just, we're just waiting for the next caller or, or waiting for something interesting to happen. Bang, that could have been the word you were thinking of, and if you weren't calling, you've only got yourself to blame, quite frankly. So jump on the phone now. If you have another word that you don't think anyone has said yet, then get on the phone, 1902 There it is. Top flight, our very first word to go, our very first answer to go. So remember, you're looking for, could be a word, could be part of a word, could be a couple of words. In this case, it's like a word and and part of a word. Top flight meaning, of, of course, you know, like um, first rate or superior or the, the, epitome, the epitome of something. Top flight. <laughs> Let's get cracking, everybody. 9802 Who's going to be the first call through with our second hot word? In any order, jump on the phone. Every phone call tonight that you make to the Meat Mansion is going to cost you just a flat rate of 55 cents from a landline. Hi, from mobiles. Please make sure you are 18 years old or over to play in a game or else uh, we will whack you like this. Come on, now. This is, this is what will happen. Now I'll come around to your house if you're under 18 trying to play. Bend over and do this to you. Like that. Smack you. <laughs> just, just smack you on the doodle like that. Now make sure you get the bill pass permission before you call or else they'll do the same, but possibly with a giant polystyrene foot. I don't know. <laughs> Now, you can call as many times as you like, set yourself a little budget and then get cracking. You never need to register. It's a two-step process on the phones. If you're on hold right now, stay right there. This is how you play. You're looking for uh, a word or words or part of a word that comes before light, something light. OK, now you're looking for it up here in the grid. There's our first answer to go tonight. Now, just like this answer, our answers could be going, could be taking one or more 90-degree turns, just like this. All right, now, the, they will only ever take... And they will only ever take um, uh, turns horizontally or, di or, or vertically. They will never take diagonal turns. All right, if your word has a diagonal turn in it, scrap it. Put it out for recycling. And they'll only use each letter in their own self, in their own word once. Now, having said that, the next five hot words could potentially be using letters from other hot words. So the, the next, next hot word could use letters from that one. I don't know because I don't know what the words are. I'm relying on you. Now, as well as words turning corners, they could also be going in straight lines. Horizontally, vertically, diagonally. You know how it works. Forwards or backwards. Just like our old word searches, except these, the word finders, we have these curly words too. They're not curly tricky at all. They're all pretty straightforward. This is, our, this is why this is our favourite game, because everything is right up here in front of you. In fact, there is still 5,000 bucks staring at you in the face from the grid up here. OK, there are more than five answers, but only five of the answers that you can see up here in the puzzle are potentially going to earn you $1,000. But only if you call in quick, because it is double money. Don't wait for the money to drop back down to 500 before you start dialing. Now, some people get into this thing where they just sit there here watching, watching the shenanigans and going, I'll, I'll wait for the next person to call through and I'll hear their answer. I'll wait for two more calls. I just want to hear a few more, you know, here, it's done. Don't do that. The next five calls, it could be the winning answers. Then we have to scrap the game and start again. Play something else. All money's gone. So here's the thing. If you can see a word up there that you don't think anyone has said yet, that no one's spotted, jump on the phone. 1902 maybe, maybe you've been watching for a while and you've uh, been making a list of all the words that people have said. Good idea. Maybe you've just joined us. That's OK. There's still five grand up here for grabs. Don't sit there waiting for any more callers to get through. They could take your word. You could have seen... The first word that you could have seen as you sat down could be a hot word. Don't wait for someone else to say it. Hello, you're on the mint. Who's there? Yes. Hello, who's this? What's Hi, it? how are you? Cherie, was it? Maria. Maria, where are you calling from? Um, from Gosford, Sydney. Oh, lovely. Welcome to the show. What, what have you got for me tonight? What's your answer? Yes, it's uh, pen. Pen light. Oh, pen light. Good answer. Let's see if it's there. Thumbs up for a good answer. <laughs> oh, not a hot word. Not a hot one, but that's OK, because there are still five hot words left in our puzzle. That's this thing here floating on the TV set. You're watching. It's something light we are playing. Now, it can be a word. It could be words or part of a word that comes before light. Let's light up our first answer. Top flight. Ah, that's right. See? Runs across and then turns a corner. 
That's how it's done, people. That's how it's done. Our first winner took away $1,000 cash. Thank you very much. Would you like to take away the second lot of cash? Maybe you'll walk in with a hot word, take away 1000 and then crack the old vault. Extra $10,000. That is $11,000 in play. Now, remember, words can run horizontally, vertically. They can run diagonally, they can run forwards and backwards, and they can also turn corners at right angles, turning more than once. Oh, that's right. Oh, the Robbie Angel Cupid nappy music. Well, some of you might know what that is. That's right, you are here in the Mint Mansion with Lucy and Lyle and Matt. Three hosts for the price of two. I don't know what could happen tonight already getting a little bit crazy a wee bit crazy in here but you're bound to have a good night if you stay here and if you get dialing because you could have one of the hot words don't just sit there thinking of your word muttering it to the TV saying it's got to be that word the only way you're gonna get the cash is if you jump on the phone dial 1902 Double five, double eight, double five. Give me your word. I give you one thousand dollars if it's one of our hot ones. Let's put a ninety-second clock up and oh, tick a bell. What does that clock mean? Well, it's good news for you because it means I'm guaranteed to take a call before that clock hits zero. Now that call could come through at any time but it will come through before zero. So don't wait around, jump on the phone now. Be the first one through, 1902 with your hot word. Get excited, have a three digit pin ready. I think I broke the vault before, sorry about that. I did the little Ashley Simpson on Saturday Night Live jig of, you know when she was caught miming and then she just jigged off the stage? That's what I was trying to do there when I broke the vault. Something light. It can be a word, it can be words, or part of a word that comes before light. Still five words in there in this little puzzle. It's not very big. We're not asking for 30 words, 50 words, 17 million words. We're just asking for one word. If it's one of our hot pre-selected ones, a thousand bucks. Are you dialing? 1902 is the number to call. 10 seconds on the clock and counting. Stop the clock. You are live in the minute with Lucy and Lyle and Nat. Who's that? It's Brian. Brian, where are you calling from tonight? Um, Brisbane. Fantastic. Bris Vegas. Tell me, Brian, what word have you found in our puzzle? Neon. Neon. It's a neon light. Mm -hmm. Like the ones in the bar. Not neon light. Mark it off your list. Don't repeat that one. That's not going to get you the cash, but that's okay because every wrong answer is a step closer to the right answer. Now, if you call in with one of our hot words, and there are still five in here, not only do you win $1,000 guaranteed, cold, hard, minty cash, you can also try and crack the bolt. How do you do that? Lucy, I hear you ask, through the magic of television. Oh, look at that fade. That was pretty sexy. We'll ask you for a three-digit pin. If it matches our three-digit pin, that door swings open. Oh, my gosh. Oh, that was just some amazing camera work. I have waited all series to see. It was art, pure art. If your three-digit code matches ours, yep, that door swings open. $10,000 cash comes flying your way. A little man with a gong who's been trapped in there for the last nine months. Going, woohoo, it's finally over, I'm free. Something light. What could it be? I am here in the mansion with Nat and Lyle, that's right. I know you're a bit confused. Why are there three hosts running around? All will be revealed. 
Remember, when you call the Mint Mansion, it will cost you a flat rate of 55 cents from your landline. It will be higher from your mobile phone, so pick your landline. You must be over 18 years old to call the Mint, and if you're not the bill payer, make sure you have their permission. Let's put another clock up there. I'm enjoying them so much, and... I don't know why I enjoy that. Is that wrong? I think so. What does that clock mean if you have just flicked on your TV? It means I will take a caller before that clock hits zero. It could come through at any time. So don't wait till it gets down to the end to call. Call now. Get on hold. Come through, win the cash. It's that simple. 1902 There are still five hot words in here. It's only a little puzzle. Give me that little. I think you can find a word in there. Try and find five, maybe. Five hot pre-selected words. Maybe you've never called us before. Well, don't try next week. We won't be here. Call now. Call tonight. Win the cash tonight. You don't have to be a, an old-time viewer. You could have just watched this show for the very first time and gone, who is this girl on the screen? Well, this is a girl that's going to give you some cash. All I need is a word, words, or part of a word that comes before light. You will find it in here. It'll be running either horizontally or diagonally, vertically, forwards, backwards. We can turn corners at right angles like our first winner, Top Flight. If you have a hot pre-selected word, a thousand bucks your way. That simple. 55 cent flat rate from your phone, a thousand bucks cash in your hand. What do you think? I think it's a pretty good deal. I would be calling if I was at home. Stop the clock. You're live on the Mint with Lucy. Who am I speaking to? Elaine. Elaine, where are you calling from? From Brisbane. From Bris Vegas. And what word have you found in our puzzle tonight? Limelight. L-I-M-E. The limelight and how I do love it. Is it limelight? Not limelight. And all the mint mansion housemates will be stepping out of the limelight very shortly. But that's okay. We'll all be back on to bigger, better things. We're not so late, hopefully. Something light is what we are looking for. There's still five in here. Can you find one? Are you going to call or are you going to sit there? Let someone else call and take the cash out from under your nostrils. What do you think? What's your little tactic for finding a word? Lyle likes to use a ruler and go down line by line. Nat likes to get a chocolate covered banana, go down diagonally. Robbie likes to draw on the screen with a big texter. Uh-oh. Like I said... What's going on? <laughs> That's a chocolate-coated banana that um, <laughs> Nat uses to look for words in the puzzle, amongst other things. Something light. <laughs> Something light. I told you it was going to be a fun night if you stick around. Three dangerously unbalanced hosts in one night. scary when you can just see them out the corner of your eye and they're whispering together and you know they're plotting and planning something. <laughs> something light is what we're looking for in our word finder puzzle. <laughs> oh my goodness, I'm just... <laughs> Can I have a towel, someone, please? Over here. Towel, please. Wow. You know, this is what happens while we are on air. You can imagine what it's like off air with these people. <laughs> oh, dear. I am very much going to miss living here. I won't miss Lyle leaving the toilet seat up, though. Saved by the bill. You're live on the meet with Lucy. Who's that? Alan. Alan, where are you calling from tonight? Sydney. Congratulations on getting through, Alan. What word have you found in our puzzle? Bad. Bad light. Yeah. Is it bad light? Is it bad light? I think it is here. 
Ooh, not bad light. All right. Breathe in. Compose yourself. There is still $5,000 in play in this puzzle. There's still $10,000 in the vault. That's a potential $15,000 in play tonight. How do you get involved? Well, you pick up the phone, 1902 55 88 55. You find your word, something light. It could be a word, it could be words, or part of a word that comes before light. It'll be somewhere in this puzzle. It could be running horizontally, vertically, diagonally, forwards, backwards. It could turn a corner at a right angle, turn more than once. It could have angel music. And then you get dialing. Set yourself a limit, and then jump on the phone because your 55 cent flat rate could pay off dividends tonight. Could pay off $11,000. Something light. Hmm. Now I can see some in there. I don't know if they're the hot words. They don't tell me, obviously. I don't think they trust me. <laughs> I probably would blurt it out. So I think you should find yourself a word and jump on the phone while there's double money as well. That's right, Nat doubled the money earlier. The answers are worth 500. Now they're worth 1,000. What more could you want? apart from Nat and a chocolate-covered banana. <gasps> Whatever tickles your fancy, but we are giving away cash tonight. There are still five answers in here. That's five grand in this puzzle. And each answer also will ensure your chance to crack the vault with a three-digit code. Now, I don't know how long this double money is going to last. It could go away at any minute. So I would get dialing now. Let's put another clock up. Start that clock. Let's make the cameraman work for a minute. Hmm. One minute and 24 seconds. <laughs> we will take a caller before that clock hits zero. Are you dialing? That call could come through at any time. <laughs> One minute and eight seconds and counting it down. Have you found your word? Are you on the phone? Or are you sitting back? Don't do that. If you've found a word, make sure you jump on the phone, call this number and give me your word, because it could be a hot word. 51 seconds is getting very serious. It's getting very close. We will take a caller during this break. So make sure you jump on the phone because I could be speaking to you in just a few seconds. As promised, we took a caller during the break. We have Hock on the line. Hock, are you there? Yes, I'm there. Where are you calling from? I'm calling from Sydney. Fabulous. And what word have you found in our puzzle? Uh, is it... Jacklight, J-A-C-K. Jacklight? Is it Jacklight? Let's have a look here. I know what that music means, Hawk. Congratulations. Oh, thank you. You've just won yourself a thousand dollars. Oh, thank you so much. You are so welcome, but it doesn't end there. We need a three-digit code so we can try and get you an extra ten thousand dollars. Okay. What's um, your code? Three six nine. Three six nine? Okay, nice. look at that, the little swapsies. Boobies on the side. And a uh, wheelchair and... Six, nine... Uh, yeah, stuff. Me dinner for two. <laughs> Hawk, stay on the line, though. We're going to grab your details so we can send you your $1,000. Congratulations. I think he's gone. I think he's off. He's jumping around his living room like a very excited person. Over to you, Nat. Oh my goodness, my godfathers, how are you? I've just been packing box in the back, getting ready to say goodbye to the mansion. So long, farewell. That's what we should do tomorrow night. Maybe do a bit of Von Trapp family. So long, farewell. We are playing a game, and did you just see that winner, Hawk? 
I, well, I wasn't a question to Hock. It was that was his name, Hock. He called through a break, two breaks ago, got through, didn't get it right, tried again, gave it a good old Aussie go. What did he get? Jack Light. Absolutely, thousand bucks. Thank you very much. First answer that went to this E was um, Top Flight. Top Flight. <laughs> I didn't remember that. But that's okay. Top Flight has gone as well. We've given away $2,000 tonight. And if you would like it to be part of the winner's circle, the winner's circle of life. Always oh, Lyle. We should be doing circle of life. You've got to jump on the line. 1902 double five. <laughs> it's a circle of life. It's a wheel of fortune. <laughs> 55 cents across to the call. More if you're calling up from a mobile. It's a two-step process. You never have to register for it. If you're not the person who pays the bill, ask the person who pays the bill. Otherwise, they may well smash us. So people, start getting your fingers warmed up. Embrace the digital age. Just like Katrina does every Saturday night. 1902 double five. <laughs> double eight. Double five is the number you need to be dialing. The way the game works is simply thus. We're looking for maybe a word, maybe a couple of words, maybe just a couple of letters before light. They are all in here next to me girly bits. They go horizontally, vertically, diagonally, backwards, and they also go round corners at right angles, like 90 degrees, you know, like that. Might make it difficult, like that, or L shape, or square shapes. <laughs> like all the shapes of the windows are playful, except the round ones that go in corners. <laughs> oh, that's so confusing, isn't it? Four answers left and four chances, 4,000 left on this game. But don't fret, because if you don't win on this game, we'll just whack up another one. More money on it, thanks very much. Don't forget, if you call up and win, see that silver thing behind me? Can you see it? It's a door. It's an... Oh, what's that <laughs> on there? Oh, is that a chalky covered nana? I do love a chalky covered nana. Ah, uh, <laughs> you don't win the chalky covered nana, but what you do win is what's inside, if you can guess it, those three, what those three asterisks that represent, a three-digit code breaker. And there's 10,000 in there, so if you can guess it in the next two nights, it's yours. If you don't, every single person that calls up and has a bit of a go at the code breaker and doesn't get it right, gets put into a barrel then we're going to get Ding Dong in. She's going to come and pull out a chicken with your name on it. And if you've won it, we're going to send you the cat. How bonza is that? I say on a scale of 1 to 10, 113. Just putting it out there. Four answers left, people. Four chances. Do you want to get involved, do you? OK, three minute clock, please. Guess what's happening in when the three... OK, start the clock. <sighs> OK, let's try it again. Let's start, let's start the clock. There you go, see, making the most of it. It's a well-oiled machine. I had to do the Lyle thing because he's not here and that's usually what he'd say, but he's packing box right now, which is strange because he's, he's not... He's, he likes packing, but he's just not up houses. Double money is ending. That is what's happening before the clocks hit oh, zero, zero. Oh, look at him all oh, moving. Isn't it sad? Now the end is near. And so I face the final show, which is tomorrow. Two minutes and 27 seconds. If you're not calling now something is wrong with you. Double money is ending. The word's worth a thousand dollars now. They'll be worth five hundred soon. Five hundred isn't bad. Wouldn't be complaining if someone came up and said, "Hey, here's five hundred for you." But if you can have a thousand, why the hell not? You know, call costs fifty-five cents. More from mobile, but set yourself a budget. I like that. You can set yourself a budget, and then everyone's happy. They're all moving. They've just ditched me. Usually, like, there's someone to hang out with and you know, talk with. I'm coming in with all these jokes, being interactive. They're just like, yeah, we're just gonna move. <coughs> oh, look at you. The what are you just doing? Loops or something? <laughs> there's only one of those chairs in the house. What are you doing? I'll give it away. <laughs> give it away. We're give acting. it away. <laughs> we're acting. <laughs> give it away. Give it away. Give it away now. And that is what we are doing. But we want to give you a thousand, so you got to call before the clock hits zero zero colon zero zero or like that if you're being polite. Oh, one minute and 35 seconds left on the clock, people. Are you dialing? If you're not, because you don't have a phone, that's fine. If you're not because uh, you can't pick up Channel 9, that's fair enough. You don't even know what I'm saying. Anyway, Weird. they're the only reasons we <laughs> will accept. You should be dialing and make sure you are on hold, though, because that is a good place to be. Two-step process. You see, what happens is you dial, you go on hold, you go from hold, computer randomly selects you, does a wolf whistle because they think you sound good looking and put you through to us, apparently. But the double money is ending in exactly <gasps> one minute. Oh, when are we going to take a call? <laughs> I don't know, but I'm just going to play some air guitar. Oh, look like I'm scratching myself. One or the other, that's fine. Who's a little bit embarrassed? Put your hands up. <laughs> After everything I've done tonight, 
No. One nine zero two double five double eight double five is the number to dial. Funky peeps, you have to be over eighteen if you want to do it. It is the only way. That, that's about it. Got any? Anything else? No. Thirty-three seconds. Thirty-two. Thirty-one. Something light. Have you been inspired? Turn on the light, maybe. That, like, might inspire you. <laughs> maybe it's not that kind of light. Here's the thing. Butlers don't tell us anything because we kind of have answer Tourette's. If they tell us, it'll come out at some point in the evening. So we don't know. The only way we will find out the answers is if you call in. And the brilliant part about that is when you do and you get it right, we give you cash for your efforts. Oh, joy of joys. There is but six seconds left. And I'm excited because it means exactly what just Hello. happened. Hello. Who's this? It's Sam. What was your name? Sandra. Oh, look at me, it's Sandra D. How are you? Excellent. Wonderful. Tell me, Sandra, what's your answer for double Delight. money? What was that, sorry? Delight. <gasps> D E. Delight. Is it delight? Afternoon delights. Afternoon delights. Oh, you're joking me. Congratulations. It is oh, delight. You've won yourself $1,000. The last oh, person you, for so double much. money. Congratulations, Sandra. Tell me, though, before you just, you know, go having conniptions and stuff, we've got to get a three-digit code breaker up here to see if you won the money in the vault. So what, what's your uh, three digits? Uh, 638. 638. Can I have 638, whoever's over there? Sure. <laughs> Give me a six. Mm. <laughs> Give me a three. <sighs> Give me an eight. What do we got? Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Lucy's sucking back a scotch on the rocks. She's acting. <laughs> She's acting again. Look at it. Be a tree. Be a tree. Sandra, make sure you hang on the line. Congratulations. You won yourself a thousand bucks. Stay on the line. We'll get all your details and send you the cash. How good is that? We're still giving cash away, even though we've been boned. Don't you love that? <laughs> That's right. Here we go. Oh, and go to Lucy. <laughs> With a giant bone. <laughs> it's all right. It's okay. We still have three answers left in here. That's right, three answers are worth $500 each. She's packing it. Goodbye, by a giant bone of destiny. Something light is what we are looking for. It can be a word, it can be words, or part of the word that comes before light. The three answers are worth $500. You can also try and crack the vault. So you're playing for a potential $10,500 and a giant bone from that. It sounded a bit wrong. Something light. Three answers, they are all staring at you in the face. That's why I love this puzzle. It is my last night. You will never see me again. In fact, you know, we're all packing up and moving out tomorrow. But I'm not going to be here tomorrow, which is very, very sad. So I come in tonight, oh. ran downstairs, chucked on a frock, whacked on a bit of lippy, thought I'd come and say goodbye to you and give away some cash. That's right, I've already given away a thousand bucks tonight. So get dialing because Lucky Lucy is in the house, the lucky cat. That's right. Something light. Now they can run horizontally, vertically, diagonally forwards, backwards, and they can turn corners at right angles, turning more than once. And look, because it's my last night, I think I'd like to do a bit of a Katrina and do that. They can run horizontally, diagonally, front, frontwards, back. Oh, God bless her. She will be here tomorrow night, shimming her way into your hearts and into your lounge rooms for the, for the final time. Something light is what we're playing in this word finder here, though. Still three answers. And it's only a little puzzle, so I know you can find them. Don't say the ones that have already been highlighted because they have already gone. However, the words that have not been found could use letters from those words. Ah, oh, that's right. So get looking, get dialing. Remember when you do call the Mint Mansion on 1902-558-855, it will cost you a flat rate of 55 cents from your landline. Slightly higher from your mobile phone. You must be over 18 years old to call the Mint. And if you have the bill payer, make sure you have their permission. Or Lyle will come round to your house and show me you what he just showed me. That'll give you nightmares for the rest of your life. Oh, I wish I had a little handy cam and I could just go. Ah, uh, that would be wonderful. It would be wonderful. Something light is what you are looking for. It could be a word, it could be words, it could be part of a word that comes before light. I just thought you might like some nuts. <laughs> no? Okay. <laughs> Oh, let's have a look at some of the answers we've already had tonight. We've had top flight. There you go, see? First rate superior, there it goes. Goes across and then goes up, turns a corner. Our second answer was jack light. There you go, it's an oil burning lantern. See how that turns once, twice, and three times. There you go, like a jack-o-lantern. Ah, jack light, that's what they call it. And our last one was delight. 
afternoon delight. Actually, can, like, can you sing that, Lyle? Actually, can we all sing that? That afternoon delight thing. Afternoon delight. Um, yeah. Afternoon delight. No, no, I don't know, but we'll okay. make it up with you. <laughs> Say, say, yeah. say, afternoon, afternoon delight. delight. Afternoon Makes me delight. Afternoon Lucy, delight. I'm going to bite. <laughs> Stuff and things and blight. <laughs> oh, well, there you go. That's the explanation of delight. There you go. See how it was part of word that comes before <laughs> light. Hmm. <laughs> so when the show finishes tomorrow, we're doing a touring show called Mint Live Extravaganza, and that's one of the songs you will see on the Mint Live Extravaganza. Spectacular. Well, it won't be that spectacular. You're live on the Mint with Lucy. Who's that? It's Kim. Kim, where are you calling from? Brisbane. Kim from Brisbane with a slightly New Zealand accent. What is your word? Lime. Limelight. Is it limelight? Which I'll have to be in. Oh, it's not limelight. Not limelight. Everybody else, you are back in play. That's right. Something light is our word finder puzzle for this evening. Our penultimate puzzle. That's right. Our pen penultimate puzzle. Which means our second last puzzle. And my last night here in the mint, which is why I've come downstairs, Adam, my, my gym jams, to say hello and help pack up the house as well. Which is what the other guys have been doing amongst other things. I tell you what. <laughs> They're a wee bit naughty, and it is going to be. It's going to be some. It's going to be some. It's going to be some fisty cuffs a bit later. I think no, not really. Just pillow fights. Ah, oh, stop it, Lyle. <laughs> Something light is what we are looking for. It can run horizontally. It can run vertically. It can run diagonally. They can turn corners. They can go forwards. They can go backwards. They can turn more than once. They can use letters from these words. That's right. It's that simple. Are you darling? Have you got your word? There are still three answers. Three chances left. They're worth 500 bucks and a crack at our $10,000 vault, which if it doesn't go off tomorrow, <laughs> is coming to me. What was that? Was that you? Sorry. Gross. He's had too much curry tonight, I think. 1902 <laughs> That's Lyle in the spa. Mm. I tell you what, when we're moving out, no one's taking that spa. I, I wouldn't want to after Lyle and his curries in the spa and Millsy's mum and all that jazz. Something light. Are you darling? Have you found your word? There's still three in there. It's not a very big puzzle. Look, it's only this big. Lots of cash in there though. $500 an answer and a crack at that vault. If the vault went off tonight, it would be a lot of fun. It would be very exciting. Although there's sort of glitter all over the floor already, so I guess there'd be no more of that. But the little man who lives in the vault with the gong, when you say vault, he gongs it. See him, he's there, he'll be free. He'll be home free tomorrow. I think someone might adopt him, take him home. Love him, little gong man. I think I might take him home, that's right. We are playing my favorite puzzle, my final puzzle, a word finder. Everything is staring at you in the face. There are still three answers in there. Will you be the next winner? Will you jump on the phone? Have you got your word? All questions I don't have the answers to because I can't hear you. So jump on the phone, dial this number and tell me, yes, Lucy, I have found a word and this is the word and it could be one of our hot ones and win you a cool potential $10,500. Could be a winner like the people on our plasma screen. Hey, Lyle, who gets the plasma screen tomorrow? You're live on The Me with Lucy. Who's that? Hi, it's Rebecca. Hi, Rebecca. Where are you calling from? Um, Sydney. Fantastic. And what word have you found in our puzzle, Rebecca? Um, tea light. Tea light. Is it tea light for Rebecca? Is it herbal or is it black tea? <laughs> so crap. All right, everyone, we're still playing a game and doing the same amount of lame jokes that you've come to know and love from the Mint Mansion. Something light is what we're looking for. Could be a couple of words, could be one word, could just be a mere few letters. And all you have to do to find is have a look in here. They go horizontally, vertically, diagonally, backwards, and they go around corners at right angles. If you can find it, it's 500 bucks in your pocket. That is right. Yee-hee! Usually I'd have to wear a sports bra for that, but you know what? I'm not going to see you Christmas, so there's your Christmas present. <laughs> Oh, glory jeezy, blow crusty. 1902 555 is the number you need to dial if you want to get involved. Lyle loves this game. He loves it in the biblical sense and in the, you know, sitting down and having a Sunday and, you know, play circling in the paper. And it's definitely what it's like. It's kind of like a word find that you get in the paper or in your magazines, except it's on the television rather than on print. And here's a good thing if you do it like in your ACP magazine of choice, well, they're not merged anymore, so it doesn't matter. Just any magazine that you've done a, you know, word find in. 
You send that in after you've done it, and so do like a squillion other people, and you only win 50 bucks. Here, make a phone call, 500 bucks. Yeah, I'd like some of that. What are you doing, Lyle? Yeah. Yes? No, oh, I never knew that. Yay! Where's your wood? And that's, oh. that's what we've come to expect from Lyle. Just uh, a big flop. I've popped, oh, well, I've popped it in your box. Oh, wonderful. He's popped it in my box for me. Three hot words are left there, people. And if you want a chance at winning the cash, you've got to get involved because that's what we Aussies like to do. We love it if you get involved. I know I love it. We've got cash to give away. And if you want to get it, that's what you have to do. Did I have to say the same thing in like three different ways? Probably. <laughs> hey, I know. Let's put up a 90 second clock. Begin the clock. What's going to happen in that time? I don't know. Yes, I do. What's going to happen is we're going to take a call. Could be now. Could be before the clock hits 00, zero colon zero, 00. So get on the line, people, if you want to get involved. It is the only way to win the cash. Dial. Don't email. Dial. But if you are under 18, do email us. Just ran, you know, high shout outs, requests, need any advice, medical suggestions. I've got a suppository for every single need of your, you know, ailments, I guess. No, I don't. I just said it. I should have shut up. Jump on the line, people. There's only 58 seconds left. Each word is worth 500 bucks, and you can do whatever you like with it, which is just jolly. Calls 55 cents or more if you're calling from mobile. Make sure you're waiting on hold. It's the place to be. Turn your telly down because there's that four second delay in case we say a naughty word. I can hear Lyle plotting in my ear and I get scared when I can hear Lyle plotting in my ear. There is a call coming through at any moment. It could be now. It could be in like, a bit. I don't know. The only way to know is to wait with me until the clock gets to the end and then the caller comes through. We've given away some money so far for three answers. I'll show you in a moment. Hello, who's this? Hi, it's Julie. Hello, Julie. How are you going tonight? Good, thanks. Congratulations on getting through. Tell me, what's your answer? <coughs> Ray of light. What was that, sorry? Ray of light. Oh, listen to it like the Madonna song. Ray of light is flying since you keep on it. And I feel like I just got home and I feel and I feel like I just got We are back. Do you know what? No, we're not going to a break. I thought we were going to a break. I lied. We're not. So stick around because we're still giving away cash, though. We've given away stacks of cash so far this evening. Three grand. In fact, let's go through the answers we've already got so far. The first one we gave away this evening was Top Flight. C-T-O-P and then F, Light. See that? Awesome. Next one was... Jack light, you know, like the jack o' lanterns. That's a jack light. And finally, the next one was a delight, like running in Lyle and sing it with me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we can't. Do you know why? <laughs> why? I can see more of him than you probably can at home, and you would probably want to. 1902 55 88 55. Let's pretend it's like a Christmas party. What are you talking about? Oh, what are you talking about? Yeah. Hello, is he? <laughs> Hello? Oh, sorry, I heard a ding. <laughs> Well-oiled machine. Really? <laughs> and yeah, that's what I thought I heard was a ring. OK, I get my rings confused sometimes. Don't know my front from my back. One nine zero two double five double eight double five. We're still looking for three words left on this puzzle, but don't you fret, don't you fear, because there are still cash to be won. So if this game finishes, we'll just whack another one up and give away more cash. Lucy's dropped in to visit us tonight because she can't make it to our last show tomorrow. Devoed beyond belief. Cannot tell you. I know, she's got to go off and be Kylie for the night. Do you? Yes. Yeah, well, I thought I was lying for a moment. <laughs> hey, guess what? I've been inspired and instructed to tell you to put up another 90 second clock. <laughs> and begin! Yeehaw! That means, you know what it means, you were watching it four seconds ago when I did the last 90 second clock, <laughs> which means this, we're going to take a call before the clock hits zero, zero. It could be in five seconds. Is it? No, okay, but it could be now, or it could be before the clock hits a zero, zero, colon, zero, zero. All you have to do is call to get involved, people. We're looking for a word, it's worth 500 bucks. Don't forget that the 10,000 that is currently sitting in the vault, don't, and also, because tomorrow night's our last show, over the next few nights, we get everyone that takes a stab at the vault, everyone, not literally, literally, of course, just figuratively, everyone that tries to guess at the vault code breaker, even if you don't get it right, 
I'll explain it in a minute. We're going to go to a commercial break. And in the break, we get the clock will run down and we'll talk to you in the break. Next caller in the break, call now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> We've taken a call in the break because we promise and we're a lot heaps good like that. Hello, who's this? Jeremy. Jeremy, where art thou calling from this eve? Armadale. Armadale, lovely. Hey, Jeremy, what's your word? Flashlight. Flash. Flashlight. Oh, if you insist. Woo! <laughs> Is it <laughs> Sorry. Go on, Natty. Very good. Hey, if you've just joined us, sorry about that. It's highly inappropriate and usually I'm a lady and I would never do anything like that. We are playing a game. It's a word finder and that's pretty much telling you exactly what you have to do. You have to find words or it could be a word or it could be a few letters because they come before light. So it could be one word, two words, maybe a couple of letters before light. We've given away $3,000 so far. This is how you play the game. The words that you're looking for, the letters that you're looking for, whatever you're looking for, it's all in here. They go horizontally, vertically, diagonally. They go round corners at right angles and they also go backwards. They're like Paris Hilton, any which way but loose. Fire out of bucks is what each word will get you. We've given away three so far. The first answer was, see, see it's top F, so top light. Ah, see? Second one was jack light, like a jack-o-lantern. Yay! And the third one was delight, like sky rockets in flight. Pew! Afternoon delight. Whoop! Afternoon delight. Yes, that's right. Calls aren't going to cost any more. I know you're sitting there going, with such quality entertainment, I should be paying $5.95 a minute. Oh, no, it's not the way it goes here. It's only 55 cents a call. Flat rate from a landline. Flat rate. How good's that? It's all right, eh? If you're going for a mobile, it might be a little bit more. People keep writing and going, why do you say A? I'm sorry, I'm not as classy as people who don't sometimes. I just like it. Something light is what we're looking for. 1902 55 Make sure you are over 18 if you want to get involved because any younger and you'll get your bottom smacked by a legal person. Speaking of bottom smacking, if you don't ask the person who pays the bill the whether you can use the phone, then you will also get a bottom smacking. Just as a point of reference, though, if you do like a bottom smacking, it's probably not the right way to go about it. Hey, say, can I make the call, win the money and say, can you smack my bottom to celebrate? There you go. There's a good way of going about it. Or just a good way of spending it 20 seconds to fill for our show. Yay! Hey, as well, don't forget it's a two-step process, which you never have to register for. And is there something else I need to tell you? No, covered all the basics. Oh, you should know, though, because it's our second last show. That's right. If you've just joined us, don't be too devoed. I know a lot of people are like, yay! But some people are like, no! It is our second last show. We've been bombed. But that's OK. A lot of people like that. So, uh, email us. Hello, who's this? Hi. Hey, who am I speaking with? Teresa. Teresa, where are you calling from tonight? I'm calling from Sydney, from New South Wales. Lovely. You got a good weekend planned? Uh, no, yeah. My daughter's seven months pregnant, so I'm oh. free. Busy? I'm going to be a grandma. You're going to be a grandma. Well, congratulations to you. Hopefully we can just make your weekend a wee bit better. Tell me, what's your answer? Um, It's daylight. Daylight? Oh, that's, no one said that yet. Very good. Good find. Is it daylight? No. Oh, waiting, wondering. <sighs> uh, well, I've been moving stuff over the last half hour, so now I'm going to take a little sit down in the bar. Lucy or Nat's going to get me a drink. And, <laughs> and I'm going to go through this puzzle with you. If you have just joined us, we are playing a word finder this evening. Thank, thank you. Drink. Thank you very much. A bit of thanks would be nice every now and then. Natalie. There you go, sir. Sweaty. Powder me. God. So hard to get good help these days. Grapes. <laughs> thank you. Balloons, thank you. <laughs> High maintenance. But I think you should, please. <laughs> Mole. <laughs> Take that. Now, we are playing a word finder this evening, something light. Three words have gone already. Half of the hot words have disappeared. So do not let the other three disappear. Without you being on the phone claiming them, there they are. Top flight, jack light, and delight. Now we've got all sorts there up there. We've got uh, D-Light running uh, obviously in just a straight line. So look out for words running in straight lines, horizontally, diagonally, vertically, forwards or backwards. Or you could have words uh, taking one or more 90 degree turns. 
Here's a word that took one turn, top flight. Your first answer to go. The, uh, the second answer to go, jacket light. Took a couple of turns here. Now, as you can see, they will only ever take 90 degree turns horizontally or vertically. They will never turn diagonally. If you have found an answer that takes a diagonal turn, put it out with the recycling, like Nat. We found her in the recycled has been TV host box. Gave her another job here. I just need to give you this. <laughs> oh, Nat, you can do what you like. I mean, hey, what are they going to do? Cyrus! <laughs> All right. $500 is what he's up for grabs for each hot word, so a total of $1,500 is sitting up there on the grid. 1902 is the number you need to call to get your hands on that money. If you've been watching for a while, maybe you've seen how easily these answers just go. In fact, let's put up a 90 second clock. Let's see if we can uh, do this again really quickly. Minute 30, start the clock please, butlers. We are going to speak to someone. We are guaranteeing to speak to someone before that clock hits zero. Not on zero, but before zero. Could, could, could be in the last few seconds. It could be in the next couple of seconds. The best way to beat these clocks, if you didn't know already, was to call now, 1902-55-8855 and keep on hold. It's a two-step selection process on the phones. The second one, well, you're almost there when you're on hold. If you're in prime position then, to be dropped in at random at any stage to speak to any of us here in the mid-mansion, myself, Nat or Lucy this evening. And keep yourself minted $500 just for finding a word you have less than a minute before we guarantee to speak to one of you. It will only be you if you're waiting on the phone right now. Don't forget tonight you're playing for $500 for each of our three remaining hot words and $10,000 more in the Mint Vault. With one phone call this evening, you could earn yourself ten and a half thousand dollars. You could buy all the chalk-covered bananas in the world with that sort of money. Stop the clock. Hello, you're on the mint. Who's there? Hey, Bill. G'day, Bill. Where are you calling from? Paul Macquarie. Lovely. Hey, Bill. Welcome to the show. What do you have for me tonight? What have you got? Flash. Flash. Ah. Is it flashlight? Not there, Bill. Everybody else is back in play. You're back in play too, Bill. Give us a call. We have spoken to a couple of people a few times tonight. In fact, we spoke to Huck twice tonight and on his second call through, he won the money. So if you're one of those people sitting there going, oh, I'll never get through. Well, you won't with that attitude. <laughs> and people like Huck, and Suzanne, who's also called through twice tonight, will take your turn for you. They've gotten through twice. Thank you, Nat. Don't forget, it's our second last night tonight in the Mint Mansion, so if you want to send in any emails, any favourite Minty moments, any just general shout-outs, whatever you like, send them in. Here is one from Paul. She says, hi, just a word of thanks for the prize money I received from Channel 9 and the Mint. You're very welcome, Paul. It's a thousand dollars that will be well used. I enjoy watching each character on the Mint and I think Nat is one of the funniest people on TV. I think he means funny, strange, as opposed to funny, ha ha. But thank you, Paul. You're very welcome. Paul's won a thousand dollars. It's not about being called a character. <laughs> like, we, like it's a Disney show or something. Oh, hi, you folks. Call now. Suit. It's good to make people happy with a thousand bucks. We're giving you 500 tonight. But it's pretty easy what you have to do. Just find an answer up here on the grid. It's in front of you. There's a grand and a half in total just staring at you. Now don't forget I mentioned before, I've mentioned it with ways the words can go around corners or straight lines. Hot words could also be using letters from other hot words. I don't know whether that happens tonight. I don't know the answers. But sometimes hot words can use previously used letters from other hot words. So if you've been excluding answers because of that, get back to them. They could be hot words. The only sort of answer you should exclude is any that is taking a diagonal turn. They may only turn, just like top flight here, turn vertically or horizontally. There we go. Jack Light actually does it a few times. 
from delight, not at all. He's about to start talking, but oh, heck, I'll talk to this person instead. Hello, you're on the Mint. Who's there? Hello, it's Ernie. Hello, Ernie. Where are you calling from? Uh, Sydney. Lovely to speak to you, Ernie. What have you got for me tonight? Limelight. The limelight. Is it, is it limelight? I don't know why I've never got anywhere. I don't know why I've never got anywhere in life either. It's such a beautiful voice and presence. Presence. I think all the presents you could buy with ten thousand five hundred dollars. Bad segue, but good money. Don't forget tonight, if you do get one of our words right, one of our three remaining hot words, $500 guaranteed. No questions asked. We'll then ask you for a three-digit pin. If that code matches the one on the mint vault door, you could be a further $10,000 richer. We do only have... You could buy Las Vegas showgirls with 10 grand or Nat doing a Las Vegas showgirl for about five bucks. And when I say do... I'm not even gonna try and clarify. Let's make it worse. Every phone call you make tonight has the potential to earn you $10,500, but it will only cost you each call just 55 cents flat rate from a landline. That rate is higher from mobiles. Please make sure you are 18 years old or over to play any game with us here in the Mint. And please also try and get the bill payers permission or else they may just smash you in the judah. <laughs> it's a two-step process on the phones to be selected. We are the first humans you speak to. No one's there getting your backstory to find out whether you make good telly <laughs> or not. It's just a random process. If you're on hold, you are almost there. Please keep the phone to your ear and be ready. You could be dropped in at random at any stage to win yourself $10,500. You never have to register with the Mint. You can call as many times as you like. Once, twice, ten, fifty thousand, a million, a quadzillion, a Googleplex. Be realistic. <laughs> Search yourself a little budget and then get calling. Something light is what you're after. We've got some very good examples up there on the grid already, up there in the puzzle. Top flight, meaning the best. Top notch. You've got jack light. It's a kind, of, kind of light. I think Americans call it a jackal lantern. And you've got D light. Hello, you're on the mean. Who am I speaking to? Andrew. Andrew, where are you calling from? Brisbane. Bruce Vegas. Andrew, welcome to the show. Let me meet you up. What's your answer? Fairy. <laughs> Let's see if it's there. Fairy light. Okay, everyone's back in time trying to find it. There it is down the bottom, taking a couple of turns. Now, when you say it's not there, it is there in the grid, but it's not one of our three remaining pre-selected butlers hot words. Now, these were chosen before the show began tonight by the butlers and locked into this grid. So that we don't understand that we can't change the answers. Only those six answers chosen by the butlers before the show began can be revealed up in the grid here. Three have been revealed already. Three more to go. You know how to play this. You've played word finders before. Normally in magazines, you circle each letter in the words and you've got a few letters left and you make up a word at the end of it and you get like a coffee mug or something in the mail. If... Boring. Tonight we're giving you $500 just for finding the one correct hot word. Get it wrong, just call back. We're not going to bone you. You know? We're not going to give you a coffee mug. If you get it wrong, we're going to give you 500 bucks. In fact, let's see if I can do it in another minute and a half. 90 second clock, please, Butlers. Thank you very much. Let's start it. Let's not dilly dally. The good thing about the clocks is that we guarantee to speak to someone within the next minute 20. 
at any time in this next minute 20. We could be speaking to you, but only if you're on the phone right now, only if you're on hold. Stay right there. Of all the times to go and make a cup of tea, now would not be it. Stay on the phone, keep the phone to your ear. And hopefully it's you we're speaking to in just less than a minute. 1902 you know how to play. If you just tuned in, it's a word finder, something light. What can you find up here? We've got some very good examples showing you showing up there already. Now we're going in a break right now and we're taking our next caller in the break. Hopefully it's you. Keep on hold. Keep looking for more words. We'll speak to you very soon. Would you believe our first caller of the night, Glenn from Ingleburn, is back on the line right now. Glenn, are you there? Yep. Good to have you with us again, Glenn. What's your answer this time, mate? Um, um, front light. Front light? Let's have a look for you. Is it front light for Glenn? Second time lucky? Let's see. Oh, not there. <laughs> Nat was about to do something to me. Thankfully, she turned around again because she knew I was going to just smash her in the gooder. 1902 double five double eight double five is the number for you to call. Everybody is back in play, including you, Glenn. Glenn's been watching all night, evidently, because he called the start of the night too. Uh, so maybe people like Glenn, who have been watching for a while, might have been making a list of all the words that they've heard that have been wrong. Good thinking, because then you know when you call, you won't be saying another wrong word. If it's wrong once, it's going to be wrong all night. As I said before, there are six hot words chosen at the start of... Six, he says, holding up five fingers. Six hot words are chosen at the start of the night and locked into the, uh, the puzzle up here. Only those six can be revealed. Three have gone already, three left. Get involved now before the whole thing just disappears. Poof, just all gone. 500 bucks for each of our three remaining hot words, plus the chance to play for 10 grand in the mint vault. Two more... Limited time, bloody right. Two more nights. <laughs> it's all we've got left here in the Mint Mansion before we have to get the budget truck and move out, um, cover up all the, the stains on the carpet or else we won't get our bond back. Uh, yes, the, the Mint is, uh, is finishing tomorrow night. is our final night. So, this is good news for you. Stop cutting yourselves. This is good news. If you call through and you have a, you have a crack at the Mint Vault, which is worth $10,000, if you win it tonight, we reset the code and, and you only have to wait for like a night and a half. And if no one else breaks into the vault by then, the 10 grand is all yours. If no one has earned, has won the vault in the next two nights, then we chuck in the, uh, the names of all the winners we've had in the past couple of months into a barrel. You're right, we, we get Jack McDonald to jump in there and roll around with the frozen chooks for a bit and draw a name out of that. So the only way you can win that way is if you are, are a previous winner in the last few months. So get calling right now. 1902 In fact, I haven't given away much money at all tonight. In fact, the girls have, have given away two butler bonuses this evening. Butlers, what do you reckon? Can I give one away as well? Butler bonus? May I? Yeah! Yes, I can. Thank you, Brooks. Here we go. It's butler bonus. The next caller is going to win $50. Guaranteed. No questions asked. Well, I'll ask you for your word, but that doesn't matter. I don't care if you get this right or wrong. I'm going to give you 50 bucks. As soon as you answer the phone, say, hello, is this the mint? I'll go, yay! 50 bucks is all yours, guaranteed. <laughs> 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 just for calling through. Now, it doesn't matter, as I said, whether you get the answer right or wrong, you get yourself 50. Sound good to me? Sounds good. Sounds really good to me. Oh, it really depends oh. on where you're standing, isn't it? I'm out of crack for this one. 1902 5 Next call, I get the butler's bonus. Go, go. Show me. Show me how it's done. Show us the butler bonus thing. <laughs> Show us the <laughs> You are <laughs> SH at that, aren't you? You're amazing. You're really good. Something light is what we're playing tonight. A word finder. For something, you'll find in here. You got your suitcases ready now? Yeah, I'm just getting my suitcases. Good girl. Take them upstairs, dust them off. I've been in the garage for a little while. Do you have 50 bucks in there? Because I'm giving the next call of 50. What? I'm giving the next call of 50 bucks. Um, I don't know. I'll see what's in the bag. Have a look. <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> you sure that's your bag? In no. fact, uh, let's, um, let's put up a two minute clock. <laughs> Here's a graphic I can work with. Just there. It's nice and static. Two minutes. Let's start the clock. Before uh, the clock hits zero, we're going to be speaking to someone. And we're going to be giving that person... <laughs> I think it's Angie's Merkin. <laughs> <laughs> 
right colour? I don't know. 50 buck butler bonus is a... Large is men's chaps shoes. Going to go off Must be Bobby. in the next <laughs> 40. <laughs> All those wigs in there. I wonder who's that could be. I hope there's nothing incriminating in there. <laughs> Get the blood oh! wig. Oh, dear God. <laughs> Minute and a half to go before we're speaking to someone. The next caller is going to win 50 bucks. I keep on saying this, but I cannot <laughs> say, really say this enough. No matter what happens, <laughs> no matter whether you get the right answer or whether you get the wrong answer, I'm going to give you 50 bucks just for calling through. Sound fair? <laughs> Sounds great to me. <laughs> Not fair on everyone else. They're just sitting there going, oh, curses, 50 easy bucks. That's right, 50 bucks. No, uh, no poems from Lucy, no Buzz Monkey. 50 bucks just for calling through. 1902 And then the chance to play for 500 bucks with your answer here. And then, if you get that right, the chance to play for a further $10,000 in the Mint Vault. So you're playing with this next phone call for $10,550. <laughs> Sound good? <laughs> how, how good does it make you feel, Nat? I mean, are you, are you, does that make you just want to rip your shorts? Look at you. <laughs> Too sexy. Oh Too you have sexy. to dance with them on now. Oh love loves going to oh leave. No. Oh, no, I took them off. <laughs> Not today, 2 5 double 8 double 5 Oh, she's a graceful fairy. You really fairy. need that. You really need that. Less than 20 seconds to go. <laughs> Three answers are gone already, three more to go. I don't care whether the next caller gets them right or not. I'm going to give him 50 bucks. Butler's bonus is what it's called. Giving away the fitty is what is involved. Stop the clock, stop the dancing, put the bone away. Who am I speaking to? Uh, Denise. Denise, guess what? What? <laughs> You've won $50. Oh, wow. Yeah, I know. Just for calling through, Denise, that's our butler's bonus for you, whether you get the answer right or wrong. So 50 bucks is coming your way, Denise. Tell me, what's your answer? Uh, stop light. Stoplight, good one. Is it stoplight for Denise? <laughs> oh, Denise, not there. But Denise, you stay right there on the line. Fifty dollars is coming away just for calling through. It's called a butler bonus. Whether we'll do another one or not before the end of the show, I don't know. After the butlers, it's their bonus. But for now, we are playing for five hundred bucks for each of our three remaining hot words. <laughs> They're right there on the screen. <laughs> oh, I was just watching. Oh, sorry. <laughs> What are you doing in my shop? I was just waiting. Just watching, were you? Watching. <laughs> I totally found these in Lyle's bag. <laughs> <laughs> that is awesome. OK, everyone, we're playing a game. I know it's fun and nonsense in here, but we are still giving away cash, and if you want it, do you know what you got to do to get it? Just pick up your Telio Phono Communicato and jump on the line. One, nine, oh, two. Oh, and jump. <laughs> pick up your phone and jump on the line. That doesn't mean doing this, by the way. That's just... Oh, no. They're not mine. <laughs> OK. 1902 is the number to call. We are playing a word find. All you have to do is find a word, a couple of words, or maybe just a couple of letters that precede light. So something light. Let's go through our answers so far. We have number one. See how it says top and then F? F. Top F. That wasn't a reaction to the noise. Top F. Top flight. Get it? Top flight. The second one was Jack. There you go. Jack light. Like a jack-o'-lantern. And the third one was D light. Afternoon delights. Woo! Afternoon delights. Gosh, you know when you see me, you just wish you had backup dancers. Have you found a word? Are you, darling? Because it is, it is the only way to win the cash. Don't forget. Each word is worth 500 bucks, but if you want to win 10,000, you have to call with the answer and a three-digit code breaker. See those asterisks just behind me, the three little ones? They represent a three-digit code breaker. And if you're an idiot like the people behind me, you are dancing in your undies. But if you're not, you're dialing. <laughs> Lucy, Lucy, Lucy. That was such an interesting view from behind. <laughs> Oh, it's shenanigans are plenty in here in Le Maison, but it's not going to be Le Maison for long. Oh, see that ABBA? Do you know what that's reminding me about? Words going at right angles. <laughs> Only <laughs> ever at right angles. That's right, they do. They go like this. Hello, who's this? Hello. Hey, who am I speaking with? Sharon. Sharon, was it Sharon or Karen? Sharon. Sharon, wonderful to speak to you. Where are you calling from? Um, Newcastle. Lovely. Tell me, what's your answer, Sharon? Um, pen light. Pen light. Oh, that's awesome. I love those. Is it pen light? <gasps> I hate it when you celebrate it. Early. Unfortunately not. 
come with me. Come with me. Let's go for a wander together. Not very long until I can't wander to the Flacarchi and have a chit-chat with you, all intimate-like. Unfortunately, we're moving out of La Maison, that's right. Tomorrow night is our last night. Actually, tonight's the last night for Lucy. Unfortunately, she can't do it to tomorrow night. She's off being Kylie Minogue. Oh. Sounds confusing, but it's not. She's actually the number one world impersonator of Kylie Minogue. I hope I got that right. She's nodding yes. <laughs> I guess I love it when I accidentally know things. Everyone else, though, will be in here, so make sure you send us emails. Anything you want to ask, anything you want to see, any last requests, whatever it is. Nothing too weird. But otherwise, send them in the mint at nine.com.au. If you're under 18, definitely be doing it. Even now, we'll be reading some emails. But anyone over 18 should be playing for cash because that's what this is all about. It's all about cash. That's what Ange loves to say. Actually, I've got a list of things that everyone, everyone's little catchphrases. I can't find it. What I have found is a letter. So make sure you find the word jump on the line. It's $500 for each word. You have to be over 18. Call costs are 55 cents. If you're not the person who pays the bill, ask them. Otherwise, they'll get paper and they'll just... Oh, <laughs> I'll do that, and then you'll give me. <laughs> that really hurt. Okay, I'm going to read a letter out. It's from. Oh, um, OMG. It, no, it's not. It's from Luke Sullivan again. Please tell me that they aren't shutting down the mint. Well, they aren't shutting it down. We're just moving out and. We're not going to be on the telly. Um, I love the Mint. Well, I love you all. Nat and Lyle are my favourite hosts ever. Nat is the funniest person ever. Thank you so much. I'm so sad. Don't be sad. Are you still on on Saturday night? Yes, we are. And I don't believe it. Believe, believe, believe. Yes, it's unfortunate. We won't be here. But you've got to be pause. Wonderful things have occurred. I hope you've won cash. And if you haven't, you've got tonight and tomorrow to do it. <coughs> So if you sat there the whole time going, oh, I don't want to get involved, it, it, when they say limited time, it means limited time. You've got till tomorrow night to win money. Get involved, people. This is the only way to do it. We're looking for words or even letters that proceed like. Each call will cost you 55 cents. More if you're calling from a mobile. It's a two-step process. You never have to register for it. And if you're not the person who pays the bill, ask him. Otherwise, whilst demonstrating that they might paper cut you between the webbing of your fingers, you actually might paper cut yourself between the webbing of your fingers and then have to do the rest of the show like this. Which is a really good tie into my theory about perfume display people, how they spray out their fingers and go, want to sniff? Hi, who's this? Uh, Sonia. Sonia, where are you calling from? From Gold Coast. Sonia from the Goldie. Tell me, what's your word? Skylight. Skylight. Oh, look at you looking to the heavens for answers. <laughs> oh. I know, you're sitting there thinking, Nat, after that, I can imagine you're moving on to operatic glory. <laughs> no, <laughs> funnily enough, I'm not. Oh, you need much larger breasts for that, apparently, and horns growing out you. Oh, you know those great bustioid aeaters? I don't think either of those are words, but they, they came out. Isn't that a bit strange? Oh, like everyone does, seems to do here in the house. One nine zero two double five double eight double five. Lyle just went, damn, I was going to say that. I could see him running, going, no. You know the number to dial. You know what to do. I'm going to read out another email. You should be dialing and getting involved. Hey, Nat and Lyle. Who's this from? Rachel Elizabeth. Oh, I won't say her name. Rachel. No, yes, just Rachel. Okay, Rachel. Uh, I can't believe that tonight is the last normal Min show. Well, I guess tomorrow is, but just everyone's doing it. I just want to say a big shout out to my best mates, Jess, also awesome friends, Steph and Emily. I also want to shout out to my parents and Caleb, who is the ninth kid in our family, has just turned two months. Your parents! Like the Barossa Valley. Fertile. Uh, stay pause. Woo! I love you, pause fighters out there. From Rachel Pierce, she's 16. Unfortunately, can't play, but thanks so much for getting involved. We really do appreciate all your emails. We still will have... Um, the MySpace going for all the young'uns. There you go, MySpace, the Mintos. I can't imagine it's going to be that functional for too long, honestly. But make sure you go to the MySpace site. There will be a link to all the separate hosts' pages and they'll still be functional because we're, we're, we'll still be alive, just not working in the mansion. Rob, of course, will be doing his theatrical things. Is it? What? I, I don't know, I just I think I heard him mention once or twice that he was oh, he? doing some musical Oh, he didn't tell me. Thing. I can't remember what it's called. Is it Priscilla? <laughs> Is it Priscilla? Oh no, I think it might be it's, he reckons it's gonna be wicked or something, I don't remember. <laughs> um yes, and Angie's on Channel 9 today mornings doing um What's it called? Music jungle. Don't you music jungle and jungle gym. No. <laughs> just and going and one and two and three and four. Um and 
And I'll be on the Comedy Channel. There's a new exciting show. So I'll go on my MySpace and check that out. Lucy's going to be running around the world being Kylie. Lyle is going to be <laughs> running around in his trunks. <laughs> <laughs> and Katrina's going to be shimming for cash on corners. <laughs> one nine oh two. <laughs> that's such... Oh, Lyle, I think I'm bleeding. Um, no, that's a joke. She won't. She's... Good. <laughs> The Slurpy Machine. Oh, stop it. One nine zero two double five double eight double five. Please send in your emails. You should be looking for words, so something light. It's the only way to win cash. And it's only a couple of nights left to win cash. Let's put up a clock. In fact, can we? Please. And begin the clock. All right, people, before the clock hits zero, zero, colon, zero, zero, we are going to be taking a call. Yes, from you. You there on the couch. Stop scratching yourself. Get your fingers on the phone. Not on your fella. Sorry about that. Something light is what we're looking for. And the only way to get involved is to dial. So make sure if you're not on hold, you should be dialing. Use your digits. Or just press redial. Isn't that a wonderful thing? Uh, imagine if you still had the old rotary phones. That'd be annoying. Wow, that was attractive. OK, make sure you're on the phone, though. It's the only way to win cash. And there isn't long to win cash. So don't forget, call now, because we're going to go to a break. You know, the saucy ladies don't get distracted. Call now because we'll be speaking to you in the break and they're the saucy ladies but they're heaps cheaper. Lies, I tell you straight to your face, I tell you. We took a call in the break, like we promised. Are you there, Kim? Hello. Sorry I didn't talk to you in the break. I was getting my lips touched up by a hot makeup <laughs> chick. Now tell me, Kim, what's your answer? Is it polite? Oh, like polite. Like no. something I'm not very good at being. No, 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 not polite. Oh. Just polite, P L. Oh, Pete, like the plight of the. Yep. The plight of the show. Sh yes, the plight of the show. <laughs> Every now and then a call comes through, bam! Absolutely slaps you, cold one. All right, everyone, we are looking for exactly what Kim just did. It could be a letter before the word light. It could be a couple of words. It could be one word. All I know is that you guys have to find it. There are three still left in there. They're worth 500 bucks each. And if you want to win it, you've got to get on the phone. It is the only way to do it, people. 1902 is the number to call if you want to get involved. 55 cents is the cost of the call. More if you're calling from a mobile. 55 cents is the flat rate, by the way, from the landline. So if you're on hold for five minutes or however long, doesn't matter. It's not costing any more. 55 cents only. And what's great about that? Set yourself a budget. Know how much you spend this. Interactive high five. Run up to your telly. Yeah! Interactive high five. All right, it's a two step process. You never have to register for that process. You have to be 18 or over. Underneath, you get a right royal whip in the under the crotch area, and that really hurts. And if you're not the person who pays the bill, ask them. Otherwise, they might. I don't know. <sighs> Been nine months and really starting to run out of things. Uh, violent, they'll come up and they'll pop a balloon in your face while you're sleeping. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that was really attractive too. Uh, so, people, make sure if you're on hold, stay there. It is a good place to be. A very important thing, though, keep the phone up near your ear so if we start talking to you, you talk back. Because some people put the phone go down their pants and it's not a good place because then you can't hear us unless your ears are in your pants. In which case, we're probably the people you should be calling. But that's all right, everyone else, just stay on hold. <laughs> Sorry. And if you're under 18, send us an email. The address is popping up as I begin to read one. Boo! <laughs> How are we? I thought... So I thought I would send one last email. This is Paul, by the way. Oh, it's Diz. Oh. G'day to everyone running. Oh, Diz. Oh, except Lyle, who's setting okay. up for some stuff. Hey, dear, I hi think we're doing the exact same thing we did last time we said hi, Diz. Oh, no. Hang on. Sure. <laughs> there you go. Hi, Diz. Oh, OK, it's a group. Nat, I've just seen your message on MySpace. Oh, words oh, ring true. Oh, I can't remember what I wrote, see. but, yes, you can go on my MySpace <laughs> and check. And here's the MySpace mint address, and it links to all of ours separately. Please. I have one last shout-out, if that's OK. Of course it is, Diz. You're special. A big shout-out to all you hosts. You guys rock. Oh, look. Uh, and even if they didn't, Nat, what are they going to do? Fire us. <laughs> and also to his mates, daughters, Michelle and Megan, to my nieces and nephew, Carly, Jess and Josh, and to all the guys at www.aussiecelebs.com. You guys, 18 different flavours of fabulous. <laughs> I added that bit, by the way. I don't really have any parting words, except I wish all the hosts the very best for the future, as mentioned in the above letter. Have a ball. Do you know what? If I had a packet, I'd give them to you. Hello, who's this? Veronica. Veronica, where are you calling from, Veronica? Sydney. Sydney, yay! Tell me, Veronica, what's your word? 
Skim light. S K I M. Yes. Skim light. Yeah. Like a skim milk, but yes. light. Yeah. <laughs> and boned. <laughs> <laughs> out of the bone. All right, everybody, <laughs> let's quieten it down a little bit, but that doesn't mean you should take a little little tea break. Hell no. Keep looking at the puzzle, please, people. There are three hot words remaining. $1,500 up here in the puzzle, just staring at you. Now's a good time to get your eyes back on the grid, maybe even watching Nat a bit too long and getting a bit carried away. Now's a good time to remember why you're watching, and that is to win money. Okay, important side of the screen on the left. Kind of just time filling in over this side. Here's all the important stuff over here. Here's the puzzle that you need to conquer. One of three possible answers remain. Here's the topic tonight, something light. You need to find the something in the puzzle. Here is the other important bit. The number you need to call, 1902 to get yourself this important bit just here. 500 bucks for each remaining hot word. Get that right, you'll also have a chance this little bit here. $10,000, a total of 10 and a half grand tonight is on offer each time you call. We are playing a word finder. You're looking for a word, part of a word, or maybe a couple of words. Something that comes before light. You'll find it in the puzzle up here. Now you've got some good examples already of how these words could go. Top flight, the first word to go tonight, goes around a corner as our hot words may do, as does our second word identified this evening, jack light. Takes a couple of 90 degree turns. Now that's a good example of 90 degree turns. Our hot words tonight will not turn diagonally. They will only ever turn around a 90 degree corner, horizontally or vertically. Otherwise, words this evening could be going in straight lines, just like delight. Just there. Now those are Straight lines could be vertical, horizontal or diagonal, forwards or backwards. Have I yacked on enough now, giving you the rules? Let's talk to someone. 90 second clock please, butlers. Thank you very much, let's start it. Bang on, let's go. Within 90 seconds we will be talking to somebody out there. Might be you, unless you're on the phone. Now, this doesn't mean it'll happen in the last few seconds of the clock. It could happen very well in the next few seconds. We guarantee to take a call any time in this 90 second clock. The best place for you to be right now is on hold. It's a two-step selection process on the phones, all completely random. If you're on hold, you are almost there. You're in prime position now to be dropped in at random at any stage to speak to me and earn yourself $500 and have the chance to play for $10,000 more. Now it's only gonna cost you 55 cents flat rate from a landline and the return could be 10 and a half grand. If you like the sound of that, get dialing 1902 Don't forget to keep looking for words, even if you're on hold, even if you're dialing, keep looking at the puzzle grid. You don't want to skim over any words this evening. You don't want to pass any words by because they could be worth $500. So don't miss out. Don't think you've got an exhaustive list, you may not. You might have a few more words up there that you've missed any one of which could earn you half a grand. 10 seconds to go. Who's going to be our next caller? Are they going to be our next winner? Stop the clock. Hello, you're on the mint. Who am I speaking to? Yeah, speaking to Dan. How are you? Yeah, I'm very well, Dan. How are you feeling? Oh, really good. Oh, good. You, you confident? Yeah, I'm hoping, yeah. <laughs> Let's... I, I can see a few there, but I'll... I'll... All right, hit me with your favourite, Dan. What, what do you like? Um, I can... Well, foot. How's that? Light foot. It's, it's something light, Dan. So give me something that comes before light. Oh. Uh. Oh, right, okay. Orion. Orion's light. Orion's light? Yeah, if you look down the bottom. I can. I, I'm really bad at these, but okay, let's say not there, Dan. Orion's light, not there. Maybe you have that on your little list. Don't forget, words can only turn 90 degrees, either vertically or horizontally. Make sure your answers do that. If any of your answers take a diagonal turn, you can chuck it out, cross it off. This makes it easier for you. Less answers, more chances at winning. And you'd have even less answers if you have been taking note of other people's wrong answers. That way you know you won't say their wrong answer when you call. 
So take note, even when you're on hold or dialing and someone else gets through, listen to what they say. Could have been the word that you were about to say. And if that's the case, you're lucky. Someone's made the wrong answer for you. But if it so happens that you're sitting there with an answer in your head and someone else calls through and says that right answer, that's 500 bucks in their pocket, not yours. You should have called. Some people think they won't get through. We've spoken to a couple of people several times tonight. We spoke to Huck twice tonight. And the second time he called, he got a word right. He got Jack right. He didn't give up. He was probably making use of the fact that a few people aren't there, out there aren't calling. Do also notice uh, it's not very long to go before we have to finish the show. What happens then is that we just finish the game. We show you what the answers were. Now, I would much rather see you call and reveal the answers instead of us revealing them at the end. Let's whack it up again, butlers. Not the clock. A minute and a half? OK, let's go. We guarantee to take a caller before that clock hits zero. Make sure it's you. Have you had enough time now? Have you been looking at the, uh, at the puzzle? Worked out an answer or two? Or three? Call us with your favourite. Something light. You're looking for a word, or words, or part of a word that come before light. In fact, good examples up here again. You've got top flight, so you've got a word and a bit. You've got jack light. Got kind of a word that goes before light. And D light, obviously just part of a word. Anything that goes before light, L-I-G-H-T, that you can find up here in consecutive letters, either in a straight line or a 90 degree turning word. Don't forget, hot words could be using letters from existing hot words. I don't know what the answers are, so I can't say for certain whether that's the case. But if you have been excluding any answers because they are using current letters from other hot words, don't do that. They still could be a butler's hot word locked in before the show began tonight with six lucky answers hot words. Only those six can be revealed tonight in the grid. And in about 15 seconds, hopefully we'll find out what the next word is. Stop the clock. Hello, you're on the minute with Lyle. Who's there? Suzanne. Suzanne, again? Yes. This is, the, well, the third time tonight? Our uh, third time, lucky, Oh, this, this goes with that at Suzanne. Suzanne, what's... It, <laughs> what's your answer this time, Suzanne? What about N-Light? E-N. N-Light? N-Light. Oh, N-Light. Yes. Good one. Let's have a look. Good original answer, Suzanne. You've been Thank watching you. all night, haven't you? Thank you. Let's have a look. Oh, Suzanne, not there. This goes with that at Suzanne. Everybody is back in play. Playing this here puzzle. What have you got for us? Suzanne's been watching for a while. Glenn's been watching all night too. We've spoken to him twice. They might have a pretty good list of what not to say when they call. If you have just joined us, jump on the phone anyway. The first word you see could be a hot word. 1902 500 bucks is up for grabs. And all each call is going to cost you is 55 cents flat rate from a landline. Hire from mobiles. Please make sure that you are 18 years old or over to play the game and that you have the bill payers' permission. It's a two-step process. As I said, if you're on hold right now, please stay there. You're almost there. Hang in there. Now, you never have to register with a mint. You don't have to leave your details. You can call once, twice, as many times as you like. Set yourself a little budget and then get cracking. There is still a grand and a half sitting up here staring at you. And a further 10 grand sitting behind the mint vault. Here's how the vault works. You call and get a hot word correct. That's $500 guaranteed in your pocket. We'll then ask you for a three digit pin. If that pin matches the one on the front of the vault door, right there, you're inside, baby, 10 grand's inside. Many of you may know we only have one more night. Tomorrow night is our last night on air in the Mint Mansion. And if no one else breaks into the vault by then, the 10 grand is all yours. If no one at all has broken into the vault by the end of tomorrow night, then we will take the names of all the winners over the past few months and draw one at random to win the entire $10,000. So it's going away, no matter what. So to be in that random draw, you still need to be a winner. So if you've played for the vault at all over the past few months, you still stand a chance of winning the 10 grand. If you 
you haven't played for the vault in the past few months, call now. And get yourself into that barrel, into the chook lotto. 1902 is the number to call, as always. That hasn't changed. It'll be the same tomorrow night for the last night in the Mint Mansion. Now, tomorrow night, we will have uh, Rob and Ange and myself and Nat and Kat all playing along with you. Lucy's dropped in tonight. She has to uh, fly to Sydney tomorrow. Perform at her, in her famous 100% Kylie show up there, so she won't be joining us tomorrow night. She is in tonight, though. Let's wake up a clock. What have you got for me? Minute 30? Bang on. Let's go. You know how the clocks work by now, do you? If not, let me explain it very briefly. We guarantee to take a caller before the clock hits zero. So if you've been thinking, if you've been sitting there watching for a while going, mm, don't know whether I should call, when, when's a good time to call? Ye gods, how about now? We are speaking to someone within the next minute 10 at any time at all. Well, on the contrary, no win. Uh, <laughs> Wow. We're guaranteed to take a call in the next minute. Now, it could happen in the next few seconds, could happen in the last few seconds, could happen somewhere in between. Who's it going to be? Not you, if you're not calling. The only way to get involved here is to call up now and get on hold and stay there until the call drops through. It could be yours. 1902 Have your answer ready. And keep looking for those words. Keep looking at that puzzle. Do not let any words skim past your eyes tonight without you identifying them. We're going on a break right now, but we're still going to take a caller during the break. Hopefully it's you. Hopefully I can give you 500 bucks. Speak to you soon. Welcome back to The Mint, everybody. During the break, I spoke to the Life Be In It mascot, Norm. Norm, are you there? Yeah, I'm here, mate. <laughs> Norm, what have you got for me? Um, air flight. Air flight. Good one. Let's see if it's a good original answer. Is it one of our hot words? Oh. Oh. There you are. There I am. <laughs> 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 Welcome back to the Mint. If you have just joined us, this is the place to be. We're giving away a stack of cash <laughs> tonight. We still have three answers in this puzzle waiting to be found. If you want some cash, if you just want a whole wad of smelly fresh cash, all you need to do is find yourself a word, something light. It could be a word, words or part of a word that comes before light. Then you jump on the phone, 1902 55 Give me your word. If it's one of the hot words, you win yourself $500 cash and a crack at the vault, which has an extra 10000 bucks in it. Pretty nice if you ask me. That is a lot of cash, but you do need to get dialing if you want to get involved. Let's have a look at our winners. Look at our first one. Top flight. That was won by Mark or Michael, was it? Top flight, our second winner we had Jack. Jack Light. Hawk won that. That's right. And Sandra was our delightful third winner with delight. What an original joke, Lucy. Oh. There we go. Three winners. They have taken home a stack of cash tonight. If you would also like to get your little grubby fingers on some cash, then you need to get dialing this number with a word. There are still three hot words in there that no one has said. You could be staring at one right now. It could be looking at you in the face. Don't just sit there and wait for someone else to call with your word. Dial now. We've all been evicted from the mint. Lyle broke too many windows. We are moving out tomorrow. So call now and grab your cash now while it's still here. Let's put a clock up. Start that clock. Where's that little light thing? I really like that light thing. Not there. Oh well. Maybe I'll try it again. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh there we go. My final light thing. What does that clock mean? It means we will take a caller guaranteed before the clock hits zero. That's right, one minute and six seconds. That call could come through at any time, so do not wait. Do not hesitate. Jump on the phone. 
Have you found your answer in our word finder puzzle? Are you dialing more importantly? Because you do need to dial if you want to win some cash. Remember the words in here can run horizontally, vertically, diagonally, forwards, backwards, or around corners at right angles, turning more than once. And more importantly, it is your last chance to talk to me because I can't be in the mansion tomorrow. I'm off in Sydney. The other hosts will be here on the final night of the show. Oh. But I'll be here in spirit. So dial now, have a chat to Luce for the last time on the mint. I've been quite lucky tonight. Hmm. Sounds a bit odd. But I have given away a stack of cash tonight. I am perhaps your lucky charm. On my last episode of The Mint, I'd love to give away a bit more cash before I go. You're live on The Mint with Lucy. Who am I speaking to? I'm Alan. Alan, where are you calling from? Sydney. And what word have you found for me in the word find puzzle? Limelight. Limelight. I love a life in the limelight. I really do. Is it limelight? I got rhythm, I got music. That's the wrong answer. Not limelight. Cross it off your little list if you had one. Wasn't the right answer, but do you know what I do have here? I have a limited edition Lyle doll. <laughs> Not available anywhere, but he's a good looking doll, isn't he? Because there's a Lucy doll, you've all seen Lucy doll. She's been on the show plenty of times. There's a Nat doll. Nat doll's been on the show plenty of times. This is Lyle doll. Lyle, when you push the button on his back, he says, Wee! <laughs> Lyle says... Wee! Wee! Lyle, wee. Also, wee. Came out. Lyle also says... Wee! <laughs> what else does he say? Oh, Millsy's mum. <laughs> and he says... Oh, I, I love your intention. <laughs> it's really tense and delicious. <laughs> he also says... Um, <laughs> something really funny. <laughs> You're going to be great on that show. <laughs> we are playing a word finder puzzle, Lyle Doll. Something light. Batteries have run out, I think. <laughs> they can run horizontally, vertically, diagonally, forwards, backwards, and around corners at right angles. Can't they, Lyle Doll? Yes, they can. Mmm, Millsy's mum. He's a handsome doll, available at all. all Average toy shops. <laughs> Shut up, Lucy, or I'll smack you. <laughs> Isn't he good looking? Let's put another clock up, Lyle doll, and start the clock. Oh, I love a shiny clock. <laughs> <laughs> we'll take a caller before that clock hits the zero. Look at Lyle doll's hair. It's really hard rock black, quite like last. We will take a caller before that clock hits zero. I still have that echo on my voice, don't I? Hmm. <laughs> I can hear it. Something light. It can be a word. It could be words. It could be part of a word that comes before light or L I G H T. <laughs> We've had top light, jack light, jack light, and D light. There's still three in there to be found, though. That's right. Find one of our hot words. You win five hundred dollars, a crack at the vault, and a limited edition Lyle doll. No, not really. Sorry, that's my Lyle doll. Not your Lyle doll. My Lyle doll. So get darling because you could take home a stack of cash on this penultimate episode of The Mint, my final episode. <laughs> <laughs> 34 seconds and counting down. <laughs> Do you want the cash? <laughs> can you hear whispering as well? Is that, can you hear that? I can hear. <laughs> when you call The Mint Mansion, it will cost you a flat rate or 55 cents from your landline, slightly higher from your mobile phone. You must be over 18 years old to call and you should not be playing with dolls if you're possibly over 18. And if you're not the bill payer, have their permission. Or like a possessed Lyle doll will appear at the bottom of your bed. Stop the clock. You're live on the meet with Lucy and Natalie and Lyle. Who am I speaking to? Mary. Mary, where are you calling from? Queensland. Quite contrary, I hear, Mary. And what word have you found? Moon. Moon. Moonlight. I like it. Can't fight the moonlight. No, you can't fight it. <sighs> Not moonlight. Sorry, Lyle doll. What could the last three words be? I don't know. Lyle doll doesn't know. Garons doesn't know. 
Do you know, perhaps you have the word. We don't know, but you could be sitting there. You might have spotted a word and you're not sure whether to call. Well, let me give you some good reasons to call. One, you could win yourself $500. Two, you could crack the vault and win yourself an extra $10,000. Three, you could talk to me for the very last time. Four, you'll hear your voice on national television. Five, it's the second last night of the show, so you should call now and win the cash because if you want to get involved next week, we're not going to be here. Oh, very good reasons, Lucy. I think you're picking up the phone now. 1902 55 is the number. And this is the puzzle, something light. Word, words, or part of a word that comes before light. Top light, jack light, and D light. Still three in there and it's not a very big puzzle. Not very big at all. I think you can find a word. I think Lyle Doth thinks you can too. Ooh. He's looking at the puzzle. But Lyle Doll can't call. You can, however. Let's put a clock up. And... Oh! Yes! I don't know why that amuses me. One minute and 25 seconds in counting down. We will take a caller before that clock hits zero. Is that just annoying, just jigging around in the bottom there? <laughs> just fiddly, aren't I? There we go. He's down now. One minute and 11 seconds. We will take a caller sometime very soon. It could be in the next 10 seconds, 20 seconds, but it will be before the clock hits zero. We will speak to someone and hopefully they'll have a hot word so I can give them some cash and a crack at that vault. $10,000 in that vault. You're playing for $10,500. That's not a typo. All we need is a three-digit pin. You're lucky three numbers could open that door. $10,000 would be all yours. Now this clock is gonna finish in this next break. So we will take our last caller then. Jump on the phone now and it could be you. You could win yourself a whole stack of cash. It's a bit dark, isn't it? Whoa, oh, whoa! I broke, I broke the mint. I'm sorry, Australia. We took a caller. <laughs> we took a caller during the break. We have Joshua on the line. Josh, are you there? Yes. Joshua is a long-time watcher and caller of the mint. I've spoken to him a few times. Where are you calling from again, Josh? Queensland. Queensland. That's right. And what word have you found for our word find a puzzle? Back. What was that? B a c k. Backlight. Of course, because we just lost all our backlighting <laughs> a second ago. Very, very, very good. Is it backlight? Not backlight. Oh, well. You know what? I'm about to head back upstairs and start start packing. I just want to say to everyone, thank you so much for my fabulous time on the mid. All the butlers, all the hosts who are absolutely fully sick, wonderful people, the fabulous MySpace fans, all the fans of the show, and my family, and Derek Zoolander, and my little dog, Jess, and my mum and dad, and my family. Oh, I love God. them all. <laughs> but thank you so much. I've had a wonderful time. I hope to see you all again on another show very, very soon. But close you your eyes on. and I'll kiss you. It's been a wonderful Tomorrow time. I'll miss you. Remember Tomorrow. I'll always be, be loose. True, true, true. <laughs> and, and then, then while To, to lose. You, oh. you Good night, Australia. <laughs> what the hell? Is this song? <laughs> Singing to rely on oh. Wasn't that oh, amazing? Was amazing. amazing. Oh, no, we are part of a <laughs> well oiled well -oil machine. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Lucy. Keep packing, please. Huh. Did you sort through my socks and jocks drawer too? I haven't even started packing yet. I'm getting all emo. Don't mean mascara will run. <laughs> hey, uh, we're yeah, still Lucy's playing a game, though. Up. Yes or no, Devo? Lucy's got to finish up too soon. Oh, no. Oh, what are we going to do? Well, we've got to pack this up pretty soon, so um, how about you all start dialing? We'll be starting a clock fairly soon, so don't let that happen, please, before you call through and uh, earn some money on... Um, on the puzzle. Yes, you can't That's win the Lyle doll. doll. Nah, Do, do you know what's wrong with this Lyle doll? His hair is way too good. <laughs> <laughs> it's just, oh, it's, there we go. We'll just make it look just a little bit Just mess it up. Oh, I'm peroxided too. Peroxy <laughs> underneath. 
Do you want Proxy to take that Loxie. for the night? You can sit well, there. Well, Proxy on. Loxie's finished the show now, so you can step in. <laughs> <laughs> Little model mint bar is sold separately, so you can sit in the See, now Lucy's it. gone kids say anything. <laughs> Gee, she's hot. What are they going to do? <laughs> Fire <laughs> us! Something light. <laughs> Get going, everybody. <laughs> We're looking for words. The three have gone so far, but there are still three left, but the show doesn't have that much longer left. No, it doesn't. As in tonight, well, and tomorrow night as well. <laughs> but uh, this puzzle doesn't have much longer left either. How about we give it a five minute clock? <gasps> you are inspiring. Bad cop, bad cop. <laughs> bad cop. Let's start it. Bad cop, bad cop. What <laughs> bad you gonna host. do? What you gonna in less, do? Well, in less than five minutes, we're gonna have to just give away the puzzle. We're gonna have to give away the final three answers. <gasps> give it away, give it away now. Uh, I'd rather get out the knitting needle, needle again than uh, see this puzzle disappear <laughs> into the ether. No! Yeah. Jump on the line, give us a call. One nine zero two double five double eight double five is the number to dial. As always. To speak to Lyle. Don't be in denial. <laughs> call and smile. Rub it on your paws. Can I just say... Go, oh, you know how Tell in the supermarkets Lyle. they have that sort of last minute impulse buy thing? Oh, yeah. I was in the supermarket down the road the other day from the mansion and I swear in my life there was, there was anusol in that section. And like chewing gum I can understand, but surely you would know if you had hemorrhoids or not. Do you know what hemorrhoid cream is really good for? What's that? Hemorrhoids. <laughs> no, it's really good for under your eyes to get rid of the bags. Because <laughs> it restricts blood. Uh, anyway, uh, vessels. Something light is what we're looking for. It could be words, it could be That's multiple home words. <laughs> Second level. And it also could be just a couple of letters. All you have to do is jump on the line because there's only three minutes and 55 seconds left on this Truth. game. That's crazy. <laughs> what are we going to do? We're well, gonna go crazy! I don't wanna give away the, the answers. Oh, this might be a wiener. Hello, who's this? Bill. Bill! Where are you calling from, Bill? Paul Macquarie. Wonderful, we Bill. We spoke to you before, Bill, didn't we? Yeah, yeah. Hey, right, second time. You're on to well, it. Well. Giving it a good Aussie go. Well, tell I me, what's your answer, Bill? Pulses. What was that? What's your answer, Bill? Foot. Footlight? Yeah. Is it footlight? I hope so. Is it footlight? That reminds me of those, no those little Asian kids with those, those sneakers. <gasps> the sneakers that light. That light. Oh, I'm so jealous. And so goes, wicking, 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 How wicking, good wicking. are they? Oh, you so should be cute. dialing. And do you know what you could spend your money on? One of those? Yes! It, it would go with my propeller hat too. <gasps> awesome. <laughs> Whoever got you, that must be the best person in the oh, whole world. Oh, no, she's, she's a FedEx model, but she's a, she's very generous. <laughs> and a junk in my trunk. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah. with all that junk? All that junk inside your trunk. <laughs> I'm going to get, get, get you. <laughs> Minted. See that? that was, Before that I even clear. got told. Yeah, back on, come on. Really? Three minutes and 13 Don't seconds left. Alcohol. That's a good 13, idea. 13, is that auspicious? Do you think it's bad luck? <laughs> no. <laughs> no, it's not. It's good luck. You should be dialing if you're on hold. Stay there. It's a perfect place to be. 500 bucks is what you could win. There's still 10 grand in the vault. And don't forget, if you call up and you have a stab at the vault, what? even if you don't win it, you're still going to go into the uh, barrel, I you're guess it is. You're doing very well. I'm just letting you go. Thanks. You How is this you gaming it up tonight? I know. <laughs> well, someone's got to. Oh, it's no. a random computer drill, so if you go in and you don't get it and no one gets a bite tomorrow night, chances probably low. Everyone who's gone for a go, goes into the ye olde <laughs> barrel, which is now a computer, and if you win, you get the 10 grand. So, oh, you're like, yeah. even if you don't, even if you win one, like, word, but you don't win the vault tonight, mm. you could win on Monday night. How's that? That's not a real barrel anymore, because you wanted to jump into a barrel. Yes. But now you can't really jump into the computer unless it's, like, Tron. Devo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I love Tron. Don't even start me about Tron. I want a Tron suit. the Tron random generator. <laughs> remember back in the day? Oh, no, you don't remember back in the day. You could have, like, a race with Mills. Like, you'd have some brightly coloured line coming out behind you. You that, can't race have brand Mills. Because of his sharks. Mills would... If we ran past a reflective surface, that would He'd be stop, it. Yeah. A hubcap. Oh, look at me. Mm. Loving myself sick. Magnum. One minute, 58 seconds left to go, people. Oh, one minute, 58 seconds left. So if you're not dialing um, your... Pinching and rolling, probably. And Lyle's going to sing a song about that. Pinching and rolling. Don't give it a scratch when you can do something better. Just give it a pinch and roll and then have some cabana and feta. <laughs> nice. Don't you love it when you can eat, when you, when you can talk about scratching your crotch and hors d'oeuvres well, at Meldrum. the same time? Yes. <laughs> Thanks for the contract. <laughs> do yourself a What's flavor. What's up, Marcia? I know. Do I yourself their a... <laughs> Just watch my pitch. Okay, you're welcome. We are mining up nuggets this evening, and if you want to win billions of billions, you've got to give us a call. One minute and 14 seconds left on the clock, and about 
24 hours left of our sanity. So <laughs> if you would like what to... What are they going to do? <laughs> Virus! The puzzle is ending, though, and we are going to be revealing the answers. If you don't call, what, uh, what are you going to do to them? I'm, I'm going to kill you, and, like, you'll be reincarnated as... Gretel Colleen's eye bags. <laughs> Gucci and Prada. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you honky Friday, yes. <laughs> 44 seconds, seconds left, left on the clock. My uber wonderful pos fighters out there. If we don't give this uh, more cash away, I'm going to cry. Hey, we're going to go to a commercial break. Yes, but final call during the break. Make sure it's you. Keep on hold. Keep Ooh, dialing now. Get on the hold. Ooh. And 500 bucks. Ooh, could be yours. What are you doing, Matt? I'm or... crazy, crazy, crazy. We've taken a caller in the break. Hello, last you're caller. there, Therese. Yeah, I'm there. Congratulations, you're <laughs> the last caller of the cool. evening, second last caller forever. Of... No. no, 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 no I, last um, night. I'm going to say, I've got two different ones, but I'm going to say stop. Spot, like spotlight. STOP. Stop. Oh, stoplight. Sorry. Stoplight. <laughs> I, Not there. Let, let's, let's look at the final answers. What do we got? Image lights. Image lights. Oh, like, like if you go, oh, <laughs> bend over. The sun. Oh, Klieg the light. Now, now, I've just got to hand this by the light. Um, a Klieg light apparently is uh, is a floodlight with an arc light source used in film studios. Of course. Next. There you go. Fly by light. light. I love that one. It's an aircraft. No. It turns. It turns. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> we Get have had it. some wonderful letters tonight. We haven't got yes, to some have, of the particularly wonderful one from Drew, who's as, as usual put in the hard yards. But it's so good. What are we read it? We're going to read it out tomorrow night, Drew. Lip so thank you very much, Pia. It's waiting. It's a little uh, bit here's wet. Here's a very quick one. Uh, this is from uh, I can't remember uh, Matthew James. No, the Mid Mansion is closing. Yes. Uh, please tell me it's for renovations. Yes. No. Nat and Lucy <laughs> cries. I'm going to miss you, girls. Oh, me too. You just bring that smile to my face. Nat, I emailed you ages ago saying how my boyfriend dumped me. He saw you on oh. TV and asked me out again, so thank you. High fives for teamwork. Oh, high fives for BJ. High fives for BJ. I love getting you all. Getting them late. Getting them paid and getting them late. That's what I'm doing, yeah. <laughs> date and await. Date and mate. you got date and mate, Possibly no procreate yeah. if you're not careful. <laughs> the Lord baby Jesus wills it so. Tomorrow night we have uh, everyone but Lucy, quite frankly. Yeah. She's in Sydney, but she's we've she's got Matt and I, and Rob and Kat all coming. <laughs> it has been a pleasure spending the second night with you. Oh, come and wave with us Thanks again. Thanks so for joining us. Good night, Australia. Everyone.